Hello, YouTube. Hello, volume. Get some sweet Zelda music while Jack gets his glasses. So if you got smack to talk out, talk about him, do it now. I always get this theme confused with the uh, Hunter Hunter theme from the original 1999 anime because they both have a lot of Celtic in them. Celtic or Celtic? Is it either? Is it both? I don't actually know. So what are we doing? We're still Bane. We're on the cabana, and we found out last time that we did not have to do slide puzzles. Oh, cool. Yeah. Right? Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, we can't... You looked it up and you said it was just rupees? Yeah, just rupees. And we did... We got the, uh... There was a Triforce thing? A did chart? we get it yet? Under the, under the house. Yeah, we went through the maze and everything. Oh, you remember okay. that? Yeah, we got the first one. Uh, how much... I wonder how many, uh... So, uh... Oh, I know, I know where one is at. I, I hit the steam button by accident. That happens. Where's the... Ah, uh, what's the map button again? Z? No, that's not it. Up. Up on the deep end. There you go. Let's try all the buttons. <laughs> uh, Stone Watcher Island. There's one, because we, did, we didn't have the gloves when we passed by there earlier. Yeah, so we need Ghost Watcher Island, and at some point we need to do the ghost ship. Yeah. Ghost ship is gonna... Because there's a chart specifically for that somewhere. I don't know where, though. We could also just look it up, because it's at specific places at specific times. Yeah. Does fast travel not go there? Or are we at the closest? Oh, I don't think so. This is, uh, this is the original on, uh, Dolphin. It's not going to be significantly faster. Yeah, unfortunately. Uh, Which we do the dolphin version because I mean the, the Wii U does have it has a HDMI, but it's still. It's I, not I as think nice. It, no, it'd be lower resolution than this is on on a it's PC. Not, it's not as nice looking, like for some reason. And so this is, we have the two dungeons available to us. Yep. We're gonna pro probably gonna do at least one of those this stream, and uh, I will. We'll almost certainly look up just a list of the Triforce parts, right? Yeah. The locations. Was we we've been procrastinating this because of the tri the Triforce. Yeah. The, the here's Char the thing. The thing about like uh, about this game, the thing that I think is really the weakest part of this game is the Triforce piece on. That's not an that, uncommon opinion. That is, it, it's like this this game would be a whole lot easier if you like cut that out and like added like maybe two or three more dungeons. Yeah. Like they ran out of they ran out of ideas for dungeons. I, I th get the feeling they kind of wanted to recapture that uh, Zelda One vibe of like, you know, you talk with all your school friends. Uh, hey, I found this Triforce chart. It's in this location. But <laughs> unfortunately, the internet exists, so it was a valiant attempt, but it ended up just being tedium to look the, up. I think the thing is about like why about Zelda One is that. The stuff is well hidden, but it's also not really a pain to get anywhere in Zelda 1. It's not the, It's not hard to access, it's just hard to find where yeah, exactly it's at. The challenge is in, like, the exploration and just knowing you gotta, wow. like, fire random fire into, like, a bush to unlock another dungeon. Exactly which bush, exactly which part of the wall. There's a lot of guessing and checking. Uh, this is, I'm, you know, I'm gonna fire off what the kids are calling, a. Uh, a hot take now, and I'd say that I don't think Zelda 1 for me aged very well. No, I would it not was, say it's particularly well designed. It's, it, I mean... I get, compared to what for, existed for the, at, compared the, to what existed at the time, it was an expansive game on the yes. NES. Yeah, it was, it was a really good... It still good, had design flaws. Yeah. As uh, early games are want to have. It's very rare to have, like, a, a perfect uh, I, NES I, game. Like, what, what, uh... They weren't very, like, most of them were very arcadey, very simple. Like, yeah. Burger Time was on the same console that Mario 3 was on. <laughs> oh, 
Oh god, Mario 3 was like the most complicated NES game, wasn't it? Wasn't it? Like, you either that or like, or like one of the JRPGs. You're a fucking creep. <laughs> I'm leaving. <laughs> oh man, our alternate... We have like alternate uh, personalities for characters when we talk about them. Like good guy Ganon and... Uh, and pirate Link, yeah. and uh, well, that makes it more fun. And creepy, and uh, and like creepy, jovial young Link. Uh, what's uh, what's what's our uh, personality for Bane? <laughs> I have not seen The Dark Knight Returns or Rises oh. or whatever it was. <laughs> no, this will make it even better. Like, what do you think he is? Uh, I, I, I have some knowledge of him from like the comics continuity. He was like imprisoned, and he has like. Super drugs flowing through his body at all times, right? Uh, Something not, like that. Not the Dark Knight version. The Dark Knight version is, wears a mask because it's like it constantly gets him high because he's like in constant pain or something. That's a, that, that sounds face. apt with yeah. the the like comic version of the character. Yeah, just uh, as a result of also th like before he was like just another dumb muscle, right? Yeah. Then uh, then they just decided, you know what's scarier than a big. The big, scary, strong, giant dude. A smart, big, scary, strong, like, giant dude. So they made Bane, like, some kind of weird soon suit quote quoting, like, uh... Yeah? Just, like, genius monster, and it was actually... I don't think that's gonna I work. Know, I know, I know. I wanted to try anyway. I mean, it was worth a shot, I, I guess. This camera is not good for this room. I don't want to drop. It. I'm trying. Yeah, it's hard. In the 64 games, you just pressed it while standing still and it dropped. Not so in this one. Well, they tried to make it uh, more simplified in this one. Did you just shoot it with a bow? Oh, no, you don't have the bow. Oh, I can't. Can oh, no, I? you do. I thought Armos were bombs. You got him, you, now you, like, attack him. You're really out of sync today. Oh, no, they're, they're because it's behind him, of course. That of course. Me. You know, like in the 64 games, where Armos' weakness was behind them. All, all Zelda games are the same. been a while. Uh, yeah. I, I suppose. <clears throat> Oral Knots defines parody Bane. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, 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 that's the one I was talking about. <laughs> Did you see those videos? I have not seen, uh, I don't watch Oral Knots. No. Oral Knots, uh, they had a video called, like, Bane Outtakes, right? Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> So they had, so it's just them redubbing over like uh, Dark Knight scenes, but with like a a Bane that is like <laughs> all their villain like stuff is just really funny. Yeah. Uh, but uh, Bane, uh, their Bane is basically, what did you have for breakfast? Answer him. I was asking you, bagel with cream cheese. You heard, you heard the phrase. You are what you eat, cause when I look at you, guess what I see? A bagel and cream cheese. <laughs> just... What are you? <laughs> um. Oh yeah, no, that scene is better. You see that scene in its entirety, right? What? The one where the Gordon Ramsay? No, 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 not not Gordon Ramsay. That's what I was referencing. Oh, fucking raw. What are you? An idiot sandwich. So you're just killing a bunch of, uh... That's it, just a gauntlet. Oh man, I would've loved to... Oh well. A certain amount of entertainment watching, uh... Zellrog struggle with combat. I'm not struggling. I lost yeah, half a heart. Settle down. You, 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 like I was talking about the early one. You did fine there. <laughs> Settle down. 
<laughs> Do I yeah. sound agitated at all? Nah. I've watched the Majora's Mask videos. I know when I'm fucking when I get. Yeah, fucking those, those those finished. We got the all six parts of Majora highlights out. Freaking cafe art. We fucked up the. Also, I figured it out. You know why we didn't have the Fierce Deities masks? Because we didn't. we didn't save after we died. We to... didn't go into the room and then do it. Because we went back in time while we were still in the field. Yeah. I, if we had tried maybe getting the mask from him, going into the fight, and then resetting time, if that's possible, we might have had it. I don't know. Yeah, well... <laughs> Wait, what's next? What are you... Oh, are those dark nuts? Or, those sorry. appear to be dark nuts. Oh. <laughs> you just fucking took out that pillar! Sure did. Oh, oh, hello. Oh, hello. I'll get these later. I'm almost full on rupees. Ow. Isn't it like 5,000 is the... Oh, no. is it? I thought it was something... Like, I thought the wall was like crazy high. I'd prefer a limit of 5,000 to, to one. We'll find out soon. Ah! Well, you got that? We well, sure taught that guy a lesson! Nope. That didn't work. Oh no, I'm trying to actually go to sword now. How does that work? It didn't. <laughs> Alright, normal way. I mean, unless you want to die... That, I'm like, trying to have fun, Jack. Did I say anything? I'm just watching. I'm just watching you doing what you're doing. I can do it on that guy. The other guy's got a helmet still. It's fun to, to throw stuff. To be fair, stuff. they were they were heavily armored, right? And you're they're also like three times your size. If he didn't have have his helmet on, I could have thrown the sword I'll, at him. I'll, I'll, also, uh. Also, you were you were like learning a new style with the hammer. See, so yeah, it's not it's not your fault. Yeah. All right. What? Do you have to guess the direction now, or? I don't think so. Oh. Some goodies just stored the pillars. Yeah. Just like you hollow out goodies. a pillar and you just store all the shit. All right. What's not lit? They all lit. This room's pretty lit. That's not lit. But is that the exit? I don't. That's the exit. So okay. other other direction. Yep. Why those dark nuts suddenly fucking appear? Oh, because we lit all four torches. Uh oh. All right. Now we gotta um. Smash it. So many. I'm glad that. <laughs> I'm glad they fixed their fucking, like, cash flow problem in this game. By adding Tingle, the greedy bastard. <laughs> oh, you want something to spend rupees on? Well, you asked for it! I get the f I've been getting the impression of late you guys don't like playing games. <laughs> Have we been complaining a lot? Have we? <laughs> I mean... We were enjoying Ratchet too. Yeah. Uh, that was that was fun. Uh, we were voicing complaints about it towards the end, but I mean, we do that about every game to some degree. We're just it's, it's, we're critical. Yeah, we're critical. <laughs> Try for start. How much does it cost per map? I'm gonna I'm gonna look it up. I want to say like two hundred. Okay. I, mean, I think I remember it being fifty. Fifty would be nothing. Critical, you mean curmudgeon <laughs> You know, I'm I'm the lenient one. I just I just point stuff out because I find it amusing. Or like, if there's an actual problem, I'll tell it. I'll say it's a problem. But yeah. all right. So there are eight. So there are eight. Uh. 
I think Islet of Steel has one that we haven't been to yet, so I'm gonna Yeah, go that's there. what I saw. I saw it. That was the first thing that popped up was, uh, hey. A little fortified base. We're gonna blow up, how blow off the... Alright, Tingle Island. H how much? Wait! What? I... A thousand What? Per? How bad is it? Oh, God. Is it? It's a thousand. You said 200, per. right? It's a thousand. 398. For one... That's yes. a very specific number. That's a very... Hello, ships. Don't Damn. mind me. So we can afford, like, three of them. So we need to go... We need to actively go treasure hunting. So 386 times 7, right? That's because you're... Oh, no, they're... Whoops. Ah, oh, whatever. See ya, boat. Have a good life out here. Do you, do you need the boat? I don't know. Oh, he came with <laughs> he me. He came with... Fuck you, Link. I'm not staying out there. <laughs> Just looking at you like, what the fuck are you thinking? Alright, so yeah. What? Man, can I hit stuff with it? The king can hit stuff with it. So yeah, we need we need all this fucking cash. Even then, four hundred isn't undoable. We're gonna we're gonna run into lots of money. So four. If we run out, we can always just do a dungeon. Yeah. Yeah. So. Uh... So, 398, and then, how many Triforce charts are there? Eight. Eight. Three, okay. Math. Calculator. That's 32,000. Or 3,200. 3,000. Fuck. So, still less than a full 5,000. Yeah, so we're 2,000. So, we're about, like, 2,000 off. Alright. Oh, I'm sorry. Am I boring you, king? My advest in in adventure to get the Triforce. So they just they're just they're just guarding a fucking map here. Got it. Gondola your way out of there. We... So do you have uh, ghost ship locations? Oh, uh, you gonna go after that one next? Might as well. Unless you have any other suggestions for the immediate present. Uh... Charles. No, no I don't. Uh, let me see. Give me... Load the fucking... There we go. We have three Triforce charts. One, two, and seven. Okay. Seven was, uh... Stonewasher Island. That was the gauntlet. Uh... Are they not numbered? Okay, yeah, no. Uh, you're looking for number four, then, right? That's one, the ghost ship one. Just all but one, two, and seven. Okay, so three is a s Stone Watcher Island. Okay, wait, didn't we, we just did that? Uh, are they misnumbered? There's two. There, there are two marked for Stone Watcher Island. Okay, what what are they? Uh, get raise the tread. Get the Triforce chart chart two from Bird's Peak Rock. We have that one, right? You said two? We have one, two, and seven. So, but then the treasure... This makes no sense. What the fuck? So they're numbered incorrectly. No, I don't think they're... Guide. No, oh, okay, I guess they are. Just read from the top. What's number one on that guide? All right. Triforce chart number one is the Islet of Steel one. Okay, got that. Triforce Shark number two is, uh, Bird's Peak, is Bird's Peak Rock. Okay, I guess we should find where that's at. You said we have two, though. We do, but that's not numbered correctly. What the fuck? What kind of weird fucking shit? It doesn't mention where Bird's Peak is, does it? Uh... Oh, it's actually called G5. McLinkus's Oasis. <laughs> so, that one. That one, yeah. That's the one you need to go. Why are there more than three charts? Aren't there only three Triforce pieces? Uh, I think it's only one of the Triforce thirds is split into eight, right? 
Yeah, so like this the is the third of the Triforce, but they further split it into eight in order to, like, make sure that, like, Ganon didn't get his fucking mitts on it. Which, I don't know how exactly a triangle splits into eight, but this isn't the first occurrence of that in the series. You know, it's just a hammer. For some reason, I didn't, didn't... Like, like, you take a hammer, you just fucking hit it. Wasn't, that was the plot in Zelda 1, wasn't it? That the Triforce was in eight pieces? Yeah. So this is a shout out to that. But those were in dungeons, though. Yeah. I... Well, you know, a tiny little island with a, a battleship in front, that's kind of dungeony. Mini dungeons. Man. Yeah. What is what does Wind Waker involve or not Wind Waker? Does uh, Twilight Princess involve the Triforce at all? I don't remember. Like, not the part I remember. Wasn't of it. the plot of the game something about like another reality just like creeping in? Something like that. Parallel Twilight Dimension. God, playing that game is gonna be a trip. I swear. It's gonna be a very stark contrast to this game. This game's like fun pirate ocean aesthetic. And now we'll show you the real superpower of teamwork. Smash cut to Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> Where are those damn Chaos Emeralds? <laughs> Alright, you got the... Paint my chart, fish. Cliff Plateau. Okay. Uh, Maybe this is the place. Yeah, there's, there's there's a shard here, actually. Oh, okay. With uh, seagulls? Uh, what the fuck? Okay. You find the worst, apparently hardest to read guides. This is IGN! Yeah? The, they, they really need to get their shit together. What the fuck? Oh, wait! Wait a minute! Is Wii U HD? renamed them! Yeah? So... So you're using the Wii U so guy. So this is five! So we don't have five, do we? Uh, I think we might need the hookshot for here. We need the hookshot... Don't we have... No? No, we don't. We get that in one of the dungeons we haven't done yet. It only says... It says the only requirement is a cannon. A cannon? Yeah, this is, uh... For the cliff plateau place? Yeah, let, let me... Uh, in the can you look up a guide specifically for not the Wii U version for this version? Okay, give me a moment. Horse chart. Wind Waker GameCube Twilight Ooh. charts or twi Game. Triforce charts. Okay, this looks this looks like a, a, the the place we're inside a place. No, fuck you, IGN. Okay. Game game FAQs. Good old game FAQ. When did they get bought out by uh, GameSpot, by the way? Because mm -hmm. that seemed to have happened recently. Like, or. Go down. Die, plant. Ow. He does not seem to be. There we go. Alright. Here we go. Uh. So, uh... So I'm guessing... This lead of steel was uh, what the one we were on. What? That's the old chart we got. That's one of the ones we've got, yeah. 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 That's good detail, so... I love throwing shit. <laughs> I know you do. Oh. Bird's Peak Rock, that's where we're at, right? No. Okay, so that I I, I, I Cliff Plateau Island. Or Cliff, Cliff Plateau. Plateau Isle. Needle Rock Isle? No. Cliff. For some reason these uh, flaming torches can be brought inside flowers. Okay, I I realize what my 
what my fuck up was. Yeah. It's uh the guide was talking about like where the shards were actually were rather than where the guides actually were, but this guide actually separates the the charts and the and Oh that's right. After we get the uh the charts and all, we have to come back and actually read them to find the locate the things. Yes. So But it seems like you're in the right dungeon for the chart. Twilight Princess was my first Zelda game, and much like Shadow, I thoroughly enjoyed it. Oh. Unlike Shadow, I have no idea why people diss it so much. Do a lot of people diss uh, Twilight Princess? I'm sure because it was, like, radically different from, like, uh, the... People diss this game for being radically different from the 64 ones. They basically... It was, uh, also... Twilight Princess was very, uh... <laughs> It was very grimdark for a Zelda game. It was kind of the only one that was like that. Which, you know Even what? Even among Majora. Majora was, like, whimsically, psychologically Wait, okay. dark. The difference is that, uh, is that, uh, if Twi Twilight is, uh... uh Majora Twilight Princess is Berserk, and, uh, and Majora's Mask is, uh, is, uh, Paranoia Agent. Yeah. That's, that's the difference. It's creepy versus edgy. It, it's... It's creepy despite the fact that there's an apocalyptic event in three days. And I think I think what separates the two is that, yeah, the, that lack of edge. It was just more depressing. It was a depressing, uh... Majora's Mask is... It also gave for more exploration. I remember, again, going off limited memories here, so it's probably not a fair judgment. I remember Twilight Princess being fairly linear and directed. Which, you know, that, that would probably make it... I, people were bitching about, like, the non-linearity in this game and how it opened and everything was. So they're like, oh, we'll fix that! And then Twilight Princess... It was a very knee-jerk change. But not even knee-jerk, but a very stark change. You know what? At least it'll be simple to get through. Yeah. Then, if that's the case... Fish, where are you? Maybe this is the place I was thinking of that had the seagulls get you something. Fish! Uh, is there a... There's gonna be a Octorok around here. Either of you played Black Flag? The Assassin's Creed? Uh, I played the Assassin's Creed Black Flag game. That was... That's a good time, actually. If there was... Would be an uh, Assassin's Creed game I would stream, it would be that one. Because that one's plot is, like... Is, like, really stupid in, a, in, like, a fun way. I was interested in that rare Pirates game. Oh, yeah. You know the, the one? I don't remember the name of it. I don't know which one you're head. talking about. Yeah, that one. It's just, I, I think it's fairly expensive, and it is not on Steam, and you need a good rig to run it. There's some barriers. Yeah. I'm sure our rig is up to it now, but... It's expensive and not on Steam. Rare? That, ki like that, kind, is, that kind of kills Is it a out lot of games. print? I, I don't know. Is it an I doubt it. Game? I think they're still. They might still be updating it. Oh, I thought I, thought I was. Th I was thinking of another game. It was the one with like a cartoony. Yeah. Aesthetic. It's within the past couple years. Yeah. God damn! Just you and like eight and like seven other players just manning a a pirate ship, and just firing cannons and steering and shit. Okay, I, I remember. We got pairs, we got... Oh, we got, we got one uh, shot. Well... Okay, let's try it. Let's do what we can to scope out. Actually, first, I see something. Maybe maybe we don't need... Maybe we don't need pairs. Up we go. Up we go. There. Holy shit. Pirate climbing. You'll get real good with rope on a pirate ship. Uh-oh. I need your boot. Give me your... Give it to me. It's valuable boot. Precious go! Yeah. Uh, There's something up there. Hold on. You gonna shoot him? Maybe that's a good idea first. Go grass, please. Oh my god. We be the sharpshooting pirates. Fuck these Fuck birds. Fuck it, hell! These birds got to go. It's a fucking Hawkeye level of aiming. 
This one will make Usopp proud. Probably up more. Yeah, you're gonna have to. If only we had homing missiles. <laughs> Heavy leading. That, that, that's... Oh, is that too far away? I don't think so. Man! Is there, like, a drop? Got him! There you go. Alright. Seagulls, <laughs> come to me! You... Alright. That's a good bird. That's, oh, we gotta hit all of them? It's like a sequence of switches. Oh. How, does it, does this have a time limit? No. The, the bird, I mean. No. No? Okay. Hmm. Can't really, uh, turn. If only I could, like, shit eggs or something. Why can't you be Kazooie? <laughs> Another miss. Sid Meier's Pirates was also decent. Oh, yeah, that... I gotta play that. I heard that was, like, a really fun old game. Oh. What it, What does it want? I thought you just flew into the switches. Oh, you, you do. You do. It's just precise. Uh-oh. You missed oh, it. Oh, one's alive. You know what? It's better... Uh, at least... At least it's not... There's not as much as there were. Better one than five. Yeah. Doesn't seem to be timed. No, it's not uh -oh. timed. They just gotta worry about They're locked! Dying. They're locked on! How avoid bird? Gotta shake him! Fly faster, bird! You're being monitored. Fuck! <laughs> this is tense now. Wouldn't got... want it to be too easy! I mean... At least it's not like 50 birds. No, we got one more that's like way down. Just shake him! I'm trying. Go down, bird! Dive bomb! Almost there! Please! No! There's Is that the last one? one? No! Keep shaking him! Got that one. Is it there's the very top one? <laughs> this is... We got that one, it must be the top one. The one that was had that one bird circling. Too high? I guess. No Fuck off! shit! <laughs> <laughs> Try. It's good because we only had one try. <laughs> that was that was that was some insane flying. Good job of eating that bird. Tack's chicken suit was better than this. Tack did have a chicken suit, didn't he? Our Tack was neat because he had uh, multiple uh, weapon choices. Namely, like, uh, was a club he could whack with that let him double jump, or a pole that, uh, took away his double jump, but it gave him, like, a high jump. Oh, that's, that, I guess so they, they vary off they, of it, or? Yeah, he pole yeah, vaults. That makes sense. So it varies by a movement and, uh, weapon, weapon style. Oh, I already have it out. Oh. Submit to me, Link, and you can be my royal conductor. I'll never join you. Oh, well, it's too bad. I let you're good at it. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm just thinking of like an alternate Darth Vader. You'll have to get it deciphered somewhere. <laughs> Reflect on what is drawn here. Uh. Was there like a mirror themed Zelda game? Uh, just arguably like the Dark worlds? World, yeah. Not, not like Kirby uh, and the Amazing oh. Mirror though. 
You see I, that uh, Kirby clash? I guess we saw we yeah, watched we that saw together. That. Yeah, that. I saw I Vinny do like thirty minutes of it. It was just it was very basic. It was just a Kirby fight, both four players. Yeah, I. I it don't didn't look think like I would, there was any other other depth to it. I don't. I wouldn't want to play it. Like, that's weird. Weird direction Kirby's going in. All right. Uh, what's what's our next? Okay, let me see. Uh, Cards. We got one, two, three, and seven. So Triforce Chart Four is what we're looking for. Oh, that's right. There was one north of here. You said. Yeah. Wait, maybe. That's okay. Uh. So what, what charts do we have again? One, two, three, and seven. Four is a ghost ship location. Uh. <clears throat> what? Uh, oh. Uh. How do we see what? Can we see what type of moon it is? I guess not. I guess we'll. I need thought we could somewhere. We need the ghost ship chart. Where do you get that? Uh, Diamond Step Island, uh, F1. Well, here we are on G5. Oh, but we need the hookshot for that. Oh. Should we do, just do the hookshot dungeon? Which one is that? Oh, good question. I don't know. Let me see. Hello, bomb ship. Don't mind me. Is this a fairy island? No, oh, we've been here. Thorn this is a fairy island. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, two, three, four, five. Oh, F uh, G5 was Bird's Peak Rock. So that's what we were just at. Oh. Okay, so we got we just got two. We got these two. All right. Uh, good of them for the. Let's look at them. Let's look at one of the maps. Let's look at one of the Triforce charts. Let's see what it looks. Oh, it must be interpreted. Sorry. We've got it's it's just in like indecipherable runes. Uh? It's ancient Highland, which only Tingle speaks. Somehow. Hey King, can you translate this? I don't have hands, Link. <laughs> I can't read in this form. Sorry. So what are some of the other Triforce charts? Uh... By the way, Gale Isle is uh is the uh, is, is that the one of them? That's the uh, no. That's just keep reading Triforce charts. Okay. Hold on. Uh. Are there like a five? Is Needle Rock Isle? Are that's... there like a thousand ads on that page? Okay, so need no Needle Rock Isle is the one you're gonna sink a gold boat. You have a location for that? Uh, E one. Okay. If I remember right, uh, Patrick Warburton was in tack. The big dumb guy was voiced by Brock Sampson. <laughs> should play tack. I'm not opposed to playing tack. Alright. So you'll sink it, and then the, the ship... Well, I have a treasure circle or something, I assume. We know yeah. what we're doing. We'll go sink it. Yeah, then you pull up the treasure from its light ring. Beetle. Need more uh, bait. You got some pears for us in, ca in case we need them. I guess. Yeah. You never know. And we already have, I think, all the bait we'll need, or close to it. He's selling bombs as well. This yeah. is uh, nice. I hate you, Beetle. 
You're a ripoff artist. Give 500 per bomb. Oh, that's a shining beacon. Whatever it is. Uh, Ship, where'd you go? What are you doing over here? Go to the beacon. What is that fucking beacon? Maybe it's like a really good treasure? Well, we need that. We need cash, so let's go over there. A pirate never says no to treasure. Jesus Christ, that's... Oh, and it's, it's in calm water, so it's going to be a pain to get. Oh, hey, got great. What we got? Oh, this is a deep one. Ooh. What is it? Five million rupees. Alright. Two hundred rupees. Not bad. That's cool. half a Triforce chart. Sweet. We, that, is, that was a good haul. Bravo was in tack as well. Who was Johnny Bravo? Who voiced Johnny Bravo? Let me see. Obviously, it was Elvis. The Elvis. He's not dead. Tom Kinney was in Johnny Bravo. As Carl? I don't... You say he's... Carl sounds like he could be Tom Kinney. I don't have a cast list. I, it just says, hey... Let's see, episode reception. Per premise. Oh. Uh, Jeff Bennett. Okay. It sounds vaguely familiar. Uh, he's also Dexter's dad. Okay. Uh, Petrie in the Land Before Time films. The Man with the Yellow Hat and Curious George. Before, uh... Oh, fuck, who did him? It was like Ben Stiller or some... Some actor in the movie. Some he was actor. doing nothing else. Uh, Raj from Camp Laszlo. Uh, Dr. Jacques von Hamstrel in, uh, Lilo and Stitch the series. The main bad guy. Uh, Kowalski in the Penguins of Madagascar series. Okay. What else? Uh. Brooklyn and from Gargoyles. Biker Mice from Mars. This is a classic, uh, cartoon voice actor. Yeah. Oh, he was Clay Bailey in Shaolin Showdown. Oh, that's where I know him from. <laughs> Mr. Boss and Mr. Fizz in Codename Kids Next Door. Uh. Smee. Sm Jacob from Jacob that never. Smee. <laughs> he voiced Smee. Uh, let's see what else. Uh. He. He was also a Joker voice uh, for Batman the Brave and the Bold. Okay. That's another Batman cartoon. I never watched a Batman cartoon. Oh! He was in uh, the dub, the 2005 English dub of Nausicaa of the Valley of the Wind. Oh yeah? Who has? Kikiri. Kikiri. Kikuri? 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 G-I-K-K-U-R-I. -K -K I don't know who that is. Oh, fair enough. Well, oh, probably, oh. One, probably one of the old men. He was, uh, he was also Kiki's dad at Kiki's Delivery Service. Oh, for all of his two lines. <laughs> we're, uh, we're solid red <laughs> again, by the way. 
What the fuck? Minecraft server's off. It's just internet shitting itself. I noticed that was happening last night, too. How was, was it? I was playing Smash. Oh, he was, uh... I just press on. Well, he was also... Who is Cosgrove Thackeray? What? Co from Little Mermaid. Cosgrove Thackeray. Sound one of the, like, staff members at the castle. Maybe he was, like, the chef or something. <laughs> That's what we... Crescent Moon Island. Oh, he was a thief in the direct-to-video movie, uh, the, the Return of Jafar. Yeah. Ah, oh, Mortal Kombat, the journey begins. He was Johnny Cage. Uh, I'm trying to think. Oh, he was in the Hunchback of Notre Dame. The first one? Yeah. As? As soldiers that Frollo employed. Oh. You... What was his friend, Scooby-Doo? What's that guy's name? I'm drawing uh, a blank. Uh... He's, he's like that guy. He just does all sorts of uh, bit rolls all over cartoons everywhere. It is still red. What the fuck? Do we want to... Do we have internet? Uh... Yeah, we should. You're on your phone, on the internet. No, I'm not on the internet on my phone. I'm using the, uh... Here, I'll, I'll check it. Uh, we can't do anything here yet. No? Oh, we can. We have the iron boots. Yeah, we have iron boots. The villain is voiced by Carl Weezer. I, we still have chat. Hey, Carl! Hey, uh... Charles. Charles! How, uh... Are you... Can you see the stream right now? How's the stream? Is it alright? Oh, now it says we're offline on there. We've just been solid red for too long. Obs. The fuck? <laughs> well, we're recording. Let, let, let's smash it, I guess. Just like that, the wind goes away. It's gonna be all on YouTube, I guess. Unless it comes back. I hope it comes back. It, 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 Reconnection it's... successful. Uh, yellow? Yeah! That, that was bad. Comcast, the fuck? Just a sudden, like... Oh. Hello. Yeah. Oh, this is a temple. Yeah. Uh, yeah, this is a temple. Just learn the... At the very least, you learn the melody. Right. You know, the down note is higher than the right note. It's <laughs> the problem with having only four fucking... Like, it wasn't a problem in the 64 games. Yeah. They, no, they, they had five. They went in a, sequ in a sequence. It's not your internet being fucky. We just, we dropped dead for, a, like, a long period of time. The stream dropped. Hello! Are you the new hero? <laughs> yeah, I, are you? I am Fado of the Kikiri tribe. I appear as a child, but the eyes can often deceive. I am a most esteemed sage. Fado, who was the Fado in Uh, Fado in Ocarina was a girl, Kakiri. Uh. I had been praying here so the power to repel evil would continue to be contained within the blade of the Master Sword. The, it, is that... It, so to keep the, the Master Sword enchanted, someone has to pray at all times for forever and ever. The vil Who's Carl Weezer? Uh, Carl Weezer is the Carl from Jimmy Neutron, the fat, the fat kid. Oh! I love llamas! And he's the villain in Tack. In Tack. Tack. We need to play Tack, then. Is that I like was a... attacked by the evil Ganondorf. No, wait just a minute, him. <laughs> you, uh, you came at me first! Maybe, maybe this is proof that uh, the Kikiri just take whatever form they want to, and they're actually just little wood creatures. Yeah. At some point, Fado decided it, it didn't want to be a little girl human anymore. They're like time lords. I'm going to try being a boy, Kikiri, now. Teach him the song you just put. Look look for the one who has this instrument. 
Once once you do, I'm certain the holder of the instrument will feel the blood of the sages awaken within his veins. What's the blood of the... Are you the descendant? One wick are you... It was? Gee, I just played an ocarina on top of a clock tower to do that. It's always the king. Tell the king that I will still play, even in the next world. Uh... So he, he was just sitting here at the shrine praying when Ganondorf walked up and just fucking choked him out. <laughs> not not punched him, not put his sword through him, just put his hands around his neck and just started Right screaming. off the stage. Just so you know, I won't enjoy this. Ganondorf. Well, what did you say? A, B, C, D, E, F1. Right? Yeah. Oh, so it was immediately above Dragon Roost. Can't get on, King. That's fine. We need to do this anyway at some point. So. Also, the box ghost. That's a Danny Phantom character. I can hear the Carl in the box ghost. There are very similar voices. I don't think Jack has seen either of these shows. You, you've mentioned. Uh, I've seen a, a couple episodes of Danny Phantom. Jimmy Neutron really was kind of a turnoff for you, right? Jimmy Neutron. It looked weird in the 3D. Uh, it, the thing is, I, I tolerated it with reboot because it made sense for the world that it took place in. Like, but yeah. but with Jimmy Neutron, it's just. Well, obviously, he's got poo on his head. Also, at that time, it seemed like all animation was going to 3D and less towards uh, traditional animation, and I was, I was kind of pissed off by that because I like uh, traditionally animated shows. Yeah, they were still the majority of cartoons at that time. Like this was before uh, this was before Marvel or in like D in like Disney really just made the 3D look look really cool with the style they were going for. Yeah. Also, I'm pretty sure I was entering my edgy teen phase, so <laughs> I was re I was really like into like all sorts of violent anime, like fucking Ghost in the Shell and like Helsing and shit. So I'm pretty sure if I re if I watched it now, I'd be I'd be down for it. Neutron. So I watched all that kind of stuff, and I also continued to watch cartoons just because a I like cartoons, and b there was nothing better on during the day. Yeah. So, uh, is this the island, or are we just raiding these towers? I can find the ladder. So. <laughs> it's okay, you can make Man, it. I'm out of shape. You got it. Keep up. Alright, drop your shit! I'm here for your booty! It's a fucking whiz robe up here! It's a fancy whiz robe. What are you doing in my tower? Probably shoot him. I wanted to do this without arrows. <laughs> Forget the arrows. Just slaughtered. One wizard guarding three outposts? Oh, there's another one! You'd better be worth more. Oh god. The and this isn't even awakened yet. The Carl <laughs> Weezer guy played Yakko. Oh, they kind of home. Oh, there's a lot of them. They're making the mistake of getting close to me. That one is it. Did I tell you about the time I sniped a bird from 50 yards? Sank a bird. As he can only he can only think in pirate nautical terms. I sank that aeroplane. 
You, you mean you... You mean you, you shot it down? Link, Linkus, we've been over this. Not everything is related to ship turns. Turns. Oh, we got a treasure chart. That's good. That That's cash that we desperately need to pay off uh, that fucking... Tingle just like got sick of being nice, <laughs> selling his maps at such a bargain price. Yeah, no, he well, he's living on an island. He he needs it. He needs to make it habitable. It's his uh, it's his fucking uh, uh, I like Prospero Island. Oh, you know that that uh, you remember the Tempest, right? <laughs> Just like that island was apparently like inha uninhabitable. And what? In the Tempest. Is that a movie? That's the Shakespeare play. Oh no, I'm not familiar. Okay, fair enough. Well, we're good, we're fine. That was weird. No harm, no foul. Fish, where is you? No fish. The fish, uh, the fish here has died. There's the fish. It's in the complete opposite direction of the wind now. Uh oh. Yeah, quit your squawking. Polly went a cracker. Polly can fuck off. <laughs> Being attacked by hostile birds. We're coming. Got something for you. <laughs> yeah? Oh, hi! Seven Star Isles. So you said there was one here. Was it? Uh, I don't know. The other guy didn't. Again, the other guy seemed to throw, uh, like, chart endpoint and, uh, I'm, I'm sure the guide is for one of the two. If the, this one's for both, like so. Let's well, look see. at the section for the charts. Uh, charts. Uh, chart location. That's ghost ship. Bird's Peak Rock. Uh, private Oasis. Islet of Steel. Seven Star Isles. Needle Rock Isle. Outset Isle. Wait, Outset Isle. Stone Watcher Isle. Now the shards in Seven Star Isle. The, so not the chart. The chart for it is a, is a Stone Watcher. So if we, so if it was translated, we could get it here. Yeah, you go go somewhere. What? What? Did, what am I? What did I do? Uh, you don't know how to look up fucking guides, Jesus. I I told you the shards here, but. Well, I'm not. We're not looking for the chart. The shards. I know. Wind Waker. Game. There is two. no chart in Seven Star Isle. That's Triforce what I was trying to say. Chart. Location. God damn it! You're such. You're go go to the go to the South Temple you're place such where a, learn the, sa the You're such a spouse. Jeez. <laughs> Stop it! Ask for directions. No, you're not doing it right. Well, you're not. I was. Shut up. I was giving you the relevant information. I'm sorry you weren't, like, parsing it properly. Yeah.
Chart location. Okay, we got Island of Steel, Private Oasis, Bird's Beak Rock, Ghost Ship we still need. Uh, Needle Rock Island, we didn't get that one, the Golden Warship. Yeah, that's the one we were, I was talking about. That's the only one I think we need left besides Ghost Ship. Needle Rock Island is... Where's the coordinate, Zelda Wiki? In your defense, the ones I'm finding also shove the, ch the charts and shards together. But they clearly label which is which. Yeah? So there's no reason to be reading the shard locations. That's just me being off track. It's not the yeah. guide's fault. Okay, that's your fault. Here! This is the guide I was reading! Take a look at it! Uh, Outset Island, located at floor 30 of the Savage Labyrinth. Yeah, you don't want to look because you know I'll be right. What? Look at this. This is the chart. This is the guide I was using. I don't care if the guide's right. You were doing it shittily. <laughs> go to outs. Go to Outset Island and do the. We got to do the Savage Labyrinth for a Triforce chart, I guess. Oh, God damn it! I gotta re. I gotta readjust the wind then. <laughs> Jesus fucking. <laughs> just just Wait, no, we're... no chill on you at all. Or or you can do the the song because we're gonna need the hook shot before we can get all of them. Fuck it. We're here in Outset. Might as well fucking do it. And we need the, uh, the hook shot before we can get the ghost ship chart as yeah, well. Yeah, so... It's fine. We'll, we'll get what we need, and we'll get ghost ship as the final one. Okay, where's the entrance to Savage Labyrinth? Is it in the forest? Uh, it is up on, uh... Is it in the... It's the it's one up in the on forest, that, right? No, it's up on that cliff. Above Link's house. Oh, okay. So... I believe that's where it's at. Okay. I will open the article to double check. This area can only be reached by gliding with the Deku Leaf to a small ledge near the entrance to the Forest of Fairies. Okay, so it's in the forest. Near the entrance to the Forest of Fairies. Okay, so... Not in the forest! A small ledge near the entrance. Okay. With the Deku Leaf. Oh, you have to have the ghost ship chart to, to enter the ship. Yeah, that's that's why I, I'm I like, okay, was, yeah, we're not getting it. I thought it just assisted in finding it is all. No, I figure it's the magical energies of the ghost chart, right? Yeah, they you just, need to have something in possession of the ghost the ghost ship's energies. Yeah, that's the only way to, to like allow it to uh, to. If only I could fly beneath that rockhead. The triumph. Hey, asshole, this is where you need to go. They all looking for tri for triumphs? So, it's that stone head then. I think it's so. the only path and passage to the vortex. I believe it is a stone head, yes. Yeah. So, theoretically, I can get up on here, leap off, to, and with the wind going to the north. North? Northeast, and then uh, just curve to the left. Wouldn't it be better to get over across there first? Because that'd be a closer jump. What the oh, like over at the entrance? Yeah, that's also higher up. Yeah, you're right. Hold on, climb up. 
Alright. Here we go. Okay. So do I want to jump? Yeah, I guess I have to jump from here. <clears throat> Stonehead is over there. I have no idea if I'm going to do this right, honestly. I'm going to go northwest, oh, right? Northwest. Northwest? Oh, I've been reading my map wrong. Is that it? Over there. Kind of a tight jump. Oh. Here we go. I... Did I? Hold on. What? I don't think I was gonna... Oh shit, I really... F okay, I fucked that up. I know what I did wrong. Do we need the hookshot to get up there? Uh, I don't think so. Does it say the hookshot's required? Yes. That's the article I was reading that's IGN that sucks! I know, it does suck, yes. It's very poorly laid out. <clears throat> I was just looking up the uh, map location in Needle Rock because for some reason the Zelda wiki does not list that. Huh. You can try the leaf, or we can just come back here when we have the hook shot. I'm gonna try the leaf. I think I can make it over there. I think a lot of things will be easier when we have the hook shot. Yeah. That can't be the right way, that's really convoluted. I agree. I don't think this is the intended way to get there. I think they wanted us to have the hook shot. I'm gonna try from here. I can fucking make it. Yeah, that'll, that'll I don't know work. if it's for. I don't know if I can make it from here, not without magic, or from up on that rock. I think I've, I also think I'd run out of magic up there, but oh wait, hold on. What? Doesn't? Uh, oh no, it doesn't uh, help with magic. I was thinking we could use uh, the chicken soup, but that just uh, increases damage resistance. Doesn't it also refill your life in magic? It does, but it. But oh, we got full anyway. Yeah. All right. So you're saying from this rock? Yeah. <sighs> Just with straight That's wind. quite the distance. I think it'll be good. Pretty sketchy. Oh, I'll make it. I get the impression the hookshot was the intended method with this Fuck tree the right intended here. method, we're here now. They didn't want me to glide over to places, maybe they shouldn't have given me the fucking leaf. I'm not sure it's an option. I guess they had both they wanted both available. <laughs> Fuck off, rock. Alright, let's see how this goes. See you get your gauntlet. Bit of a million trials. Oh, I guess we have one of those in a bottle already. Yeah, I'm just healing up. Oh, maybe we should have gotten. Can, do we have access to Grandma's soup? I think we do. Yeah. Should we have gotten one for this? Yeah. I mean, or is it? I think it lasts the entire labyrinth. I'm not sure though. Well, let's go. Are they keys or are they bad bats? We'll never know, because we don't have a fairy this game. <laughs> they bleed nice just of the same. Nice of them to stop, like, right in, like, range of my sword swings. Yeah. It's really nice of them. Oh, hello. What's up? Now these look like tack enemies. Oh, hello. I 
don't know that there's any way to refill hearts in this, because there are no enemy drops. So you're really going to have to be careful about getting hit. Alright. I've got a fairy. I should be... I should make it. So we need to reach floor 30 for the Triforce. And there's also a heart piece in here. And I don't know how deep that is. So there's no enemy drops I have to worry about, right? Just no. go around killing them, got it. Alright, next. Can't risk them dropping health for you. <laughs> oh my god, isn't that how it... Oh, that's a lot of things. Alright, I got that. Should I get the hammer, bombs? You can grapple them, even. Yeah, I guess I could. Oh, there's a- there are a lot of them. Oh, that doesn't work against them, darn it. Oh, I just... damn it. Actually, wait, how do bombs work against them? Uh, oh! That's good. I like that. Bombs take forever to go in this game. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. I like that. Now it's just you. Hold on. I'm curious now. I think oh, you can also just, when he's rearing back, you can just sort him in the face. I was gonna say, what is... I guess I'll never know now. I was hoping that the ice arrows would be like... An instant killer or something. Oh well. Remember, you're not gonna get more magic or arrows either. Yeah, you're right. Shit. Come on. Floor five, same as floor one. Not no difference. Oh, oh hey, he's here. It's a mix-up. It's a very hellish room. Got little imps with uh, with with pitchforks. War as hell. Alright, what's this next one? Oh, fire keys. Okay. No effect. Oh well. Shit! Don't wanna do that. Or maybe I do. I should not be taking hits. Oh, guess not. Oh, that works. Just oh, one hit. Okay, that'll that'll work. We'll go one on one with them. This fire keys had me worried for some reason. <clears throat> oh, this. At least it's not boring. Torch in the water, it'll go out. Then you won't find the black market. <laughs> and you need that to get the onk. Jeez. Ow. Should not keep taking hits like that. 
Almost put you right in the fire. Where are the dark nuts? Are, you, are those gonna appear? I'm sure they're Wait, coming. Hold on. Oh, floor 10. Oh, there's our resting floor. Also, cash. So, 10 floors you get, uh, you get gold and goodies. I'm down with this. Alright! Next floors. So, this is a dungeon for the day. It's just the labyrinth. Uh, 51 floors total. Ah. Uh, so, not quite the pit of 100 trials. It's a pit of, it's a pit of 50, uh, 50 ordeals. Oh. So, uh, enemies don't have drops. However, you can steal items from them with the grappling. Oh! Hook, which may include hearts. Ah! <laughs> uh, thanks for the exploit. Oh, that's right. They moved the uh, the hero's charm to the bottom floor of this in the in the HD version. Because it makes more sense, I guess. Yeah. Than just her random, like, randomly piece. having the fucking thing. Just twenty joy pendants. Really? With a wet smack. Yeah. How are these I not like that. the first enemies in this dungeon? They're less threatening than the keys are. Uh. I guess because they're. they can jank you out. I wonder how early you can do this, uh. this dungeon. You just need the, uh. the, pet, the bracelets to lift the giant head. Oh, so that's so. after the tower. Hello. I guess I can take my time with these guys. Can't believe I let myself to get hit by that. Gotcha. Oh, there's a, there are a few left. What? Okay. There we go. What's Link thinking? Just like, how many more of the... No, he would be into this. He's committed now. Yeah. This hole was made for him. He can only continue going further. Wow. <laughs> oh, they're gonna spew out the little guys. Yeah, that's gonna be... Fortunately, they die quick. My sword weighs heavy. Is it the steel? Is it that I am tired? No, it is the blood. Alright, How long has this foul place been? How long have I been living next to this foul place? that from? But I, I'm just quoting off the top of my head, honestly. Here we go. There's that Lovecraftian, there's that Lovecraft short story that doesn't involve, like, uh, like, uh, 
supernatural horror. I forget what it was called, but it was like this guy discovered he inherited a castle, right? Yeah. And, uh, and he's like going to like, to like look at it because he's like, yeah, I, I'm on hard times. Like, I could really like, I'd really like to live in a castle. So he goes and he discovers that it turns out that his family, when they were royals, they were, uh, they had like some kind of weird uh, family curse on them, where they, or all of them acted like uh, like evil monsters, except for like a few of them. Yeah. But uh, apparently they were keeping like slaves, right, in like the walls, and they were and their main use wasn't for menial labor, but for cannibalism. Oh. And they just kept breeding these slaves as like human livestock, right? Yeah. And apparently Lovecraft felt the need to mention that, oh, they were so inbred, they were devolving into, like, walking on all fours. And throughout that horror, I'm looking, I'm, I read that part, I'm like, I don't think that's how it works, Lovecraft. Yeah. I don't know. I haven't... The premise sounds vaguely similar to, a, like, a gothic story. Uh, the Castle of Othello, I want to say. <laughs> that might be the name of the short story. Otranto, the Castle of Otranto. No, this, this way pre this predates Lovecraft, I think. Uh, 1764. Ah, uh, when was Lovecraft? Uh, late 1900s, or early 1900s, late 1800s. Yeah. 1764, it is generally regarded as the first gothic novel. Ooh. In the second edition, the author applied the word gothic to the novel in the subtitle. A gothic story. Like, think about how horrible it must be for those, like, fucking poor men. Like the, uh, like the Venture Brothers episode. They eat the green ones. Oh, instantly kills them with a fire with one fire arrow. If we get any other uh, grapplable enemies, we should see to. I guess we have a rest chamber, so we might not need to steal any hearts. Cash is useful. Never thought I'd hear that in a Zelda game. <laughs> well, good thing they added like a a, a cash gate. So this is floor twenty. Where's Rob? Shouldn't come here. Ah! Oh, there's another one? Yeah. I need a jump attack. Up. I hit the wrong fucking button. Somehow got the double tap on him. I'm guessing up next are gonna be like dark nuts and shit. In the Japanese version, the treasure chest at the end of the labyrinth contains 10 rupees. What? That's... So, as they made new versions of the game, they just made the, the reward for this progressively better. 10 rupees. 10 rupees. That's hilariously, like... That's hilariously low. And then they, in the, it's in the international version that they made it a hard piece. I got all three of them with one fucking Great. blow! Shit. They made it a hard piece in the international version, and then the Hero's Crest in the HD version. Just cause it's like... We should, uh, pause and save. I remember how long ago we did that. Yeah. This game hasn't crashed yet, but, I mean... Its heart hasn't stopped, but it's stuttered. Yeah. No, it's okay, I'm fine, kids. They relocated a heart piece from a treasure chest under Link's house. 
just imagine going through all of this, hoping for a heart piece, and then you find out there isn't one in here, you could have just gotten one under by crawling under Link's house. Oops. Oh, this is the one. You don't, you don't even need to arrow them, you can just throw a bomb in his mouth. Actually, I don't even need to use bombs, I could just use these. Hold on. Could, but you have 98 bombs. Link has cleared the labyrinth, its difficulty increases. What? But, oh. Is there a better reward for it after that? Shit. This just seems like a challenge room without any reward for the actual challenge. Yeah, you wanna fight? That's, that's where you do it, I guess. There, I guess there's a similar thing in uh, Twilight Princess. Fish for hearts. Oh, all they carry are fucking just their precious goo. Probably want to finish them. Yeah, I don't think they're dropping anything else. Three and three and one. What? What's the three-in-one comment related to, Charles? Maybe try playing Toon Link in Smash next time, Jack. He's my least favorite of the Links. In Smash Brothers. Yeah. It's kind of wonky playing. I never thought... I never... Oh, I know. I know how. Oh, not that. You can arrow or boomerang them. Got it. Oh, okay, that works too. A lot of the items in this game have a big wind-up. Yeah. He's not strong, that Toon Link. Then again, maybe he is. Oh, the three enemies with one arrow. Alright, next. Those guys might have hearts. Yeah. Oh, Joy Bendit. Oh shit, the Dark Knight is aggroed. battle is just like something new. We still got our ferry, but it's getting tougher. Only three of them this time. Just wait, like a, a, a wall master is gonna appear for the first time or something. Oh, there's a Wizro. Oh, what? Alright. They don't seem to disappear when you get close. Only after they attack, or you attack one or the other. Yeah. Just 
just three arrows in the face. The L targeting is kind of unreliable in this game. Yeah. I guess that's why we need a fairy. The fairy marks the target you're trying to hit. One. Is there gonna be another wizard robe? There oh. are bubbles. Shoot them with arrows before you move. The skulls. I see them. Guess it's just them. gonna wake up. It doesn't matter how slow you go. Well, the guy slept through that. Okay. First person aiming looks really janky. Ah, uh, yes! Pretty sensitive. Alright, there we go. It's the mask that obstructs his vision. <laughs> this fuck. Imagine young Link looking at Toon Link while Toon Link's wearing this shit. Alright, so two Dark Nuts. Expect Gold Dark Knight! And young Link is wearing the All Knights mask. The fucking scene from, uh. That, like, what was it called? The Good Son? Where, like, they're, both of them are just staring at each other with masks on, right? And they're not saying a fucking word, and their parents are like, oh, that's cute. Come on. You attack me now. Do you want the gold armor or the silver armor? What? Neither one? Get rid of Toon Link for Young Link in Smash. Uh, uh no. Young Link's still there. Other way around. They got rid of Young Link in Brawl, and, uh, for Brawl and Smash 4, it was just Link and Toon Link. And now in the latest version, all three are in it. He can do nothing against me at that point. Uh. Freeze. You are now aware of the fact that these two torch lights with a hole in the middle resemble a butthole. <laughs> Damn it, why'd you have to... It's too... It's too... Too deep in the stream for that kind of revelation. The fuck? There's a, there's a thing here. That's hard. We need heart. We need money. Plunder the riches of the fucking temple, he said. Yarr. God damn it. You were worried. We'll have enough money. 2001. Space Odyssey. Uh. Do I need. I have to play a song. But what if I play the wrong one? There's only one for these. It's always the same one. You have to stand on the other one, I think. I think that's the one you stand on. Is that a precursor shrine? Sure! It's the thingy! The, the triumph part. forks! Also heal me instantly. Or wait, no, that's later. Yeah. Alright, so, how do I proceed further in the dungeon? I have some bad news. Uh, do I need to... You need the mirror shield to proceed further in the dungeon. Ah, oh, darn it. I didn't know that. 
I didn't know that until I read it after we had entered either. That's fine. So in retrospect, we probably should have done the, dun the dungeons first so we had all the items. Yeah. Well, I guess let's uh, unlock that other one. At least we got the fucking map, the map, the chart. Well, we should go to the, uh, what are you doing? I'm going to, uh, can we fast travel without boat? Can't call cyclones on land. So we can go get the other song, or the other Triforce chart we can get is the one in the gold warship on uh, Needle Rock. Well, let's just get the golden warship one. Hey, Beetle. Oh, for that. Yeah. Uh, a what's needle oh, rock? Oh, fine. Let's, let's needle get rock this one is done. a five. Oh, so two, three, four. Here. Five. Yeah. Okay. Well, well, let's get to headstone first, then. Attendant to the great blue. Oh, wait, that's the wrong one. Sail. Come on, let's go. could do like aerial like spins just spin in midair 360 yeah while tone while 90s punk music plays oh. <laughs> <laughs> just black flag playing that'd be a weird mix of styles is a like a piracy game but it's got all like uh, punk stylings oh god that would be that would be pretty interesting. It'd be like some kind of weird post-apocalyptic pirate game, where like all the where you're just oh god that could be a, that could be a uh, like a, a like a multiplayer pirate game is just punk but, piracy punk piracy different kinds of punk too. You got like skater punks, and you have uh, I don't know that like other like cyberpunk and steampunk have anything to do with actual punk, but. So you can do cyberpunk pirates. Cy <laughs> yeah, they're it's the okay. greatest it's pirates of all. It's international waters, so no one can get them. Yeah, d different like boat styles with different abilities and different crew members. Then you get the steampunk pirates that with like a. Those are the heavies. Those are the air pirates. <laughs> not strong. The only air yeah, Toon Link's not strong. Why does he struggle with certain things, though? He does wield the biggest hammer of the Lynx. Yeah. songs are fucking useless. Yeah. I mean, there are there are a lot of useless songs in the other right. games. So then Hello. Fish person? Oh, great hero. Chosen by the master sword. I am Laruto. <laughs> are you an are you a ninja cuz I don't like ninjas? Why everybody asks me that? I am Azora Sage. 
For an age, I offered With, my prayer here in the Earth Temple. Why the fuck is a water creature, like, just chilling, like, doing Earth Temple shit? The, the tree person is not the guardian of the Earth Temple. I guess not. I... That always felt weird to me. Yet, yeah, unfortunately, get... due to his evil designs. Evil designs. Yeah, we need to reestablish sages. But not for all time. He was revived when he returned to Hyrule in a red wrath. Okay, he's communist. He attacked this temple and stole my soul. Killed you? Knowing that he stole my soul. Sent me but to another here, dimension! In order to return the power to repel evil to your sword, just find another to take. So, how did how did she die? Did he also strangle her with his bare hands? Uh, this one slipped out. His fish are very slippery. So that's when he. This is when he decided to learn the art of swordsmanship. No, uh, you know, he, he finished her off with the fucking uh, mid-air reverse warlock punch. Is it a she? Was that said? Laruda. I mean, could I, I don't know. Could be either, I guess. We must find the one who plays the harp. Nothing can stop the flow of time, but the fate carried within my bloodline endures the ravages of all the years. It survives. Oh yeah, that's Go right. Go find the descendant the of my bloodline, who the carries birds. this instrument. Link is just fucking... I'm talking to a fucking ghost right now. Not only that, it is a mermaid ghost. I've heard stories of this. Not good stories. I gotta get the fuck out of here. Guys, it's just like... Is this the siren song? We have different mothers, but the same father! Oh, of course. We are children of Dagon! I guess given the two interpretations, the, uh... If there were, there were a siren, it would be the fish person evolving into the bird person. <laughs> Those are like the two versions of sirens that exist. Alright, which temple's the hookshot? Well, I guess we gotta do them both, so let's just do this yeah. one. Alright, and besides, Dragon Roost Isle's like a quick warp. It's really weird there aren't fish- Yeah, very. The- the fre Zora are freshwater, except when they're not. Where the fuck are the Majora Zoras? They're- they're seawater. They're sea creatures. It is very stupid, yes. Uh, should we get the gold warship? Uh, Should we just do that after the temples? Let's just do that after the temples, because we're stalled out anyway. Okay. So we're going to... Which descendant are we going to? The harp or the, the strum? Let's go get the harp. I think... Oh. Here's here's something I can show. I, I caught this frame while doing the Majora highlights. Just an absolutely disgusted Creamia. <laughs> oh, man. Look at her. Looking at you. <laughs> Just take that frame. Like, put some text on either side. You got, you'd have a really weird J-O-I picture. <laughs> because a thriving Zora civilization wouldn't jive with the narrative. They'd rule the world. They'd rule this world. Yeah. Zora Kingdom. It, that would make you feel bad about getting rid of the ocean. Uh... Hello? <laughs> oh, it's the guy from, uh, it's the guy who manned the night shop in Majora. Listen, this... man, you're not one of the natives, are you? N no. In, uh... in another game, I could have turned into one. Guess we gotta climb again. Did I not? But I... You, you have to. How about no? That works too. I feel like a fucking either a romance scene or a musical is gonna start up any second. Yeah. The seas are alive. Where, where, where are you going? Where the fuck is she? Oh. 
Go inside. You have to go out a higher a higher exit. So atmospheric at night. Classic Zeld music. This is literally the same track. It is. It has not changed at all. That's cool. You got a track that works, use it. Oh, she's over there. Okay. Uh, which way is the wind blowing? Doesn't matter. Use your hook. You're swinging. <laughs> you don't want me to risk it with the... But I have a good track record with it. Honest! Eh? I've returned, my sweet. Do you know any actual songs, or just playing chords over and over again? Oh, McLinkus, you're okay. Those red eyes. <laughs> You've been asking me all about your adventures, McLinkus. I can rest easy now that I've seen you safe and sound with my own eyes. You're not <laughs> dead! Uh, <laughs> God. Hey, I'm alive! That's nice. He's turned into a fine young adult, hasn't he? Recently, he's even begun doing things on his own without my guidance. Joy? What? J-O-I? Huh? Oh. <laughs> Look, I'm, I'm do guessing... yourself a favor. Look up J-O-I, Buru. You'll know what I'm talking about. Okay. <laughs> you, want, you want to see some weird shit? All drawn, so... Every conversation ends up centered on you, McLinkus. I'm a popular guy. Watching Prince Kamali grow up fills me with pride. Aren't you like the same age he is? <laughs> oh, he found it! Oh, God! Talking down to him like that. Wonder if this is how a mother feels? <laughs> You're weird. <laughs> I like that about you. Must... How weird I must say a little bit. I should continue practicing. Performing music. Yes, yeah, you've the... Uh, your dragon god. Alright, how the fuck does this song go again? Your shit, let me conduct you. Let me show you how it's done. This is, uh, it's the blue one. Down, down, middle, right, left, middle. Alright. Oh. Do it like this. Is that the Wind Waker? Wow. wow! Will you conduct me? Oh. Oh, fuck! <laughs> I really... Earth God's lyric. Mysterious song. It sounds familiar. Almost as if something I've forgotten is trying to be. Uh... <laughs> we'll put her up in the Abstergo. We'll have her remember her past life. I feel like this is oh, kind I of. I gotcha. You're just. You're just ruining their lives. Could that not be said for the sages in Ocarina? Yeah, this. Fate calls, you don't have a choice. Are you a fish? Was I a fish in a previous life? That's the title theme. And then, and then I played a song with a fish. It was amazing, McLinkus. Oh, it sounds like a bad contact, eh? Hey?
This is your destiny. Oh god, I was a fish. Bathe in the glory of the Master Sword. Has the Toxic Warning logo on it? I don't oh, know. Hello, sweetie. Alright. Just now a stage spoke to me. She spoke so gently. She spoke in music. There's something that... It, so this is the first female Zora we've seen that was not Ruto. Uh, yes. Thanks to you, I've been awakened to the... Sn she was the Smurfette in the 64 <laughs> games. <laughs> kind, of a, kind of a missed opportunity they didn't use, a, like, little Ruto for, like, I don't know, a fangirl of the Indiegogos uh, or something. Yeah, maybe maybe they're like, no, we can't... I no. bet my teacher knew I was a sage all along. McGlinkus, take me to the Earth Temple. Uh, sure. I'm glad you're up to speed now. Sorry, not sorry. Let's go now, quickly and quietly. We, we gotta sneak away. Oh, come on. I just want him... To remember me as a simple attendant. This is I, I, they're both the same kind of origin of music with the Celtic. This sounds really hunter-esque though. Yeah. It's very hunter huntery. What? So she'll so just be trapped in the temple forever, never to come back. Waifu adventures, go! You're coming with me! Oh, you oh. can't! You can't look I, at her. For, as, as, but this. Wait a minute! This angle doesn't make any sense. The head disappears. Can you, you can get out of the out of the boat and look at her, right? No. Yeah. Uh, except I don't want to. No. Oh God! It's all the way down there. But you know what? Down where? Hold on. Oh, that was that the one? Yeah, you can you can warp. I think. I hope. She. <laughs> I get seasick. Don't let me. Don't warp, please. Yeah, we're good. Why does her shirt have the Toxic Warning logo on it? I mentioned that the first time we saw her. It's, uh, it's derived from, like, the J Zora logo. J-O-I what? Like, pictures. That's what I was talking about. Like a J-O-I picture. That's what I was talking about, that pic- <laughs> If you need further explanation, you, just... you should probably take it to the Discord. Yeah. No, it's, it's supposed to be like the shape of the, the Zora stone in Ocarina. Yeah, which... That's where the Goron symbol is derived from the Goron's ruby and the Kikiri one as well. Yeah, Goron... It's a shame Gorons don't exist. Now there's only the shopkeepers. So we're going east, right? Yeah, we're going the right direction. Okay. Yeah, it's a JOI picture. As opposed to a video! Oh, my apologies. Whoa! You got that... casual wear Zelda. Oh, that's... I like that. That's like if uh, if they did a bot like a like a modern day neighborhood Zelda. Like it's a Zelda game, except it's in a it's set in a suburb. I don't remember where that's from. It's some. I think it's like a 3DS uh, promotional image or something. Good promotional image. What else you got? Ah, we're almost there. I'll, I'll show pictures when we're, like, sailing. Nothing else going on. We're here. Listen carefully to what I'm about to tell you. Okay. Okay, boat. <laughs> this is, like, so out there. It's the nest of an evil creature. The same creature that stole the life of your predecessor, the sage. It's a oh, dark so, so, and frightening place. So it, it Ganondorf didn't kill her. The the monster that Ganondorf sent killed her. <laughs> he didn't. My <laughs> hands are clean. <laughs> if McLinkus comes near you and press R, bitch, you listen. Then be silent. That's basically what he's telling her, though. Like what a fuck, man, fuck. Don't do anything on your own. Obey McLinkus at all times. Nah, no, don't worry about him. He's an old boomer. Fly and carry him through the air. Oh, that's right. We have, like, uh... I mean, not Tails Flight, but we have Glide. 
Medley gets stuck and cannot continue. Use the Wind Waker to conduct you. Oh, it does have a use. The Unfuck Yourself song. Which. Mention. I guess that that's outdated now, the fact that we get a glide from her, because we have the Deku Leaf. Yeah, unless we need to get her over to a certain place. Right, so it's just for her benefit. It's, it, yeah. it's now an escort mission. Yep, it's an escort mission temple. So do we need to play this fucking song again? Probably. Hold on. Hey, you, play um, your song. Uh, down, 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 middle. What are you trying to do? I just get it in frame so I can cheat. As little as this is, there's still more of a, like, I guess more of a romantic hit hint between them than, I guess, as much as Ocarina. Tried to set up with a lot of the characters. Yeah. God, him just wearing the mask is great. Just the weird fight. <laughs> looks like it. He looks like he like, kind of looks like he could be a Far Cry villain, honestly. Yeah. Just with the like a dude wearing an ancient Aztec gold mask and just casual like wear. It's just Link weird is enough. the villain of El Dorado Two. El Dorado Two: The Return to El Dorado. Yeah. That's See, that's the something DreamWorks didn't do. Straight direct-to-video sequels. <laughs> did, did they not, though? Was it was Shrek 3, like, uh, like direct-to-video, though? Okay, well, when they, when they were doing the, the 2D movies yeah. back in the 90s, they didn't do that. Yeah, but then they got to 3D and they realized it was cheaper, so they just... But no, the Shrek movies all had theatrical releases. None of them oh! were direct-to-video. Oh, did... So, speaking of Shrek, yeah. uh, did you see the new Magic the Gathering trailer? You need Medley with you. Yeah, I know. Uh, whoops. Did you see the new Magic the Gathering trailer? No, I have not. So, their aesthetic is fairy tale, and, it, and, it, and they were playing, uh, I, like, I love you, baby, you know, the one where it goes, like, uh, you're just too good to be true. <laughs> Can't take my eyes off. No, I'm not that, familiar with that song. Oh, God, you should look up that trailer. Next time we sail. So but you yeah, thought it was like a Shrek parody. Or? No, no, no. It was uh, it was like two gingerbread bread people coming to life, right? And their hands were stuck together, and then suddenly one of the planeswalkers, Garrick, just busts in and starts attacking. He's just fighting in a kitchen against these knights. Yeah. And oh man, the the trailer is just. <laughs> and then that uh, that actual real life song is playing. All right. Hold on. I got. I'm, I'm gonna just stay here. Medley can't fight. Unfortunately, I like for her to fight. Hyrule Warriors is non-canon. Oh yeah, was she playable in? She was. Huh. She had wind powers. Yeah. Despite being in the Earth Temple. God, the Earth Temple is protected by a creature of the sea and of the air. They won't see it coming. Not only that, but if I remember correctly, the uh, the other temple has uh, wind mechanics. This one does not. You know, the one that doesn't have the bird with you has wind mechanics. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's that's to make the temple more challenging. I don't know. The fucking didgeridoo, man. So these guys have just been sealed in here ever since Ganondorf. Sorry, his monster killed the Zora Sage. <laughs> yeah, don't you don't want Gandalf to sue you for libel, man? They've just been uh, they've just been locked down here, hanging out, surviving off of bugs. They're, they're surviving off of the sheer hate that they have of their enemies. Oh, it's uh, the goblin me the moblin method. I don't think that's gonna work. Uh... Can uh, can Medley get over there by like throwing her? Well, let's see. Return of Waifu Throw! <laughs> waifu Throw You two. know, last time I did this, it was for Azora. Not very confident, but I think I should try to fly. 
I'll fly where you tell me to. Just tap A to keep me airborne. Use the wind wa wind waker. Oh, that's right. The we have the command melody, don't we? Yeah. Oh. This fucking didgeridoo, man. Whoa! Oh, it worked. Uh, bye, medley. Okay, okay, you're, you're good. You're fine. <laughs> Walk it off. It's funny, too, because uh, the other temple involves a partner that uh, can fly. Not just glide, fly. Literally fly. The there one who is not a bird flies. <laughs> Man, this game's weird. This stage of the game is very fucking confusing. I feel like they got their uh, their design focus got kind of lost. I like the idea of having like a partner go on an adventure with you. Yeah. Okay, so oh. now Link stands here, and you got to send Medley to the other one. Okay. Is there a drop? Yeah, R's drop. Yeah. Well, McLinkus, you should try to fly. You ready? I don't remember how to play it. What's the command melody? It's not the sixth one. Uh, uh, uh. Fucking hell. Why do they- why- are they, they're all so fucking convoluted! Command melody. Down, down. Command melody. Oh, oh! Okay. Whoops. I think it's structured like that because it's so hypnotic. You just play it and then it just... This is so, so weird. So, uh, what could we command Medley to do? That's been the topic of some, uh, some pictures. It's so hypnotic. Okay. Now stay there. I'm feeling more confident now. Not sure how I, how I can fly while carrying you, but I'll do the best I can. Thanks, I figured that out. Cool. Uh, oh, we're gonna have to... Do we have to command Melody her down? Yeah. We're gonna be playing this a lot, aren't we? Yeah. Left, middle, right, middle. Yeah. <laughs> this guy used two hands to conduct. God but forbid you, you, you tell her to, to jump down. Man, Link, Link suffers a lot from being mute. It's really an inconvenience. Yeah. Oh, gee, look, a treasure chest. Chest. Oh, it's it's faded out of this reality. You need you need the the treasure chest shard in order to interact with this treasure chest. What the f of the ghostly realm? If only we had a fairy to tell us how to deal with this enemy. Oh well. Oh wait, hold on. Oh, this is the mirror shield one, isn't it? There it goes. Oh, hammer. Oh, okay. Why does sunlight... I think this is the mirror shield one, and the other dungeon is the, uh, hook shot. Okay. Most dangerous choo choos. Uh, hold 
on. Oh. I feel like if Tingle was rich enough, he would be the kind of person to uh, participate in the most dangerous game. <laughs> so, but we he, still would, he would get a he would get a magic shotgun and hunt Hylians. Okay, I get it now. I get it now. I know what I need to do. God, we can uh, we can fire arrow that right to open it. I think so. Or or bomb it might work. Either one. I'll try it. Leaf's not really being very useful in this dungeon. You know, the Earth Dungeon. I guess this this game differentiates between uh, Earth and, like, uh, plant matter. Because we had the Deku Tree Dungeon, the Forest Haven. Yeah. Oh, well, that's not creepy at all. I can't do anything in here yet. I'm gonna have to move on. No one left. What? Wait, wait a minute! Oh, that's right. She... Oh! Her harp is reflective. But... Oh, I guess I never tried. Hey, hold on. Hey, hey, Medley, look this way. Yes, Link? Uh, that, more. No. Stop no. getting distracted! Over here. Over here. You might have to command her. Looking like it, unless, right? You place her very specifically. Yeah. Come it's on. like killing the re-deads without guarding. <laughs> She's not gonna. It's too low. God damn it! God damn you're, it! You're Medley. relying on random animations, Jack. <laughs> damn it! All right. I miss anything in the past 10 minutes. Uh, we now have, like, a, a little girl that we can hypnotically command to complete this dungeon. <laughs> and we talked about the absurdity of the, of the temples in this game. Oh, she... Uh, they're gonna be reflection puzzles. Yeah. Totally. Hey, you want to open this with me? No, I didn't think so. You can watch me do it, though. <laughs> she moves with you. It's good detail. <laughs> yeah. Got the dungeon map. Cool. Man, can you imagine we got to, like, uh, go through the forest temple with Saria? <sighs> I think that was a the thing they were, like, planning to do. Was to like, fight. Honestly, we should have been able to go through the fire temple with Darunia. He was he was there. Yeah. He was ready. Hey, Darunia, can you hit this switch? Sure thing, little buddy! That would have been cool. Then he gets taken out, like, fighting the dragon. You gotta avenge his death really quickly. You have a team battle. I don't think, uh... I don't think the partners come into play. What? No, Medley, why? So that actually doesn't damage you. This is curse powder. Oh, and... You now can't sword for a while. Until you go into the light. Oh, that's better than like. Uh, you can dispel it with light. It's currently dispelled. Ooh. Oh, I do need. I do need the mirror shield for this. Yeah. All right. Let's go. Go where? This door is open. Oh wait, no it's not. Uh. What was in the? Oh, I see. All right. Do you even need to dispel it to use the hammer? Or does it just stop your sword? Yeah, I can't use the hammer. Alright. Fine. Medley. I have yet to play a bad game with the word shadow in it. Sh shadow of Destiny? Have you played Shadow of Destiny?
Wasn't the bad guy in Shadow named Black Shadow? Or was it Black Doom? I think it was Black Doom. No, Black Shadow's F-Zero. Yeah. So it comes back. It's only dispelled as long as the light is aimed at it. Uh-oh. Is that good enough? Okay, that's good enough. Alright, well, I guess, I guess that's the path I'm going. Wait, what? What? Do you have to carry her in order to come through the door with you? Medley, what the fuck? How could you abandon me, Link? You're so cruel. Wow, what a... I guess we did get a uh, escort dungeon in uh, Ocarina with Ruto. Of sorts. She was more, uh... She was more just an item to carry than uh, actual, like, she didn't do anything. She... You could put her on switches. Wait. Oh, the boomerang's ineffective? Yeah, gonna have to arrow. Or do that. That works, too. Gonna <laughs> have to arrow, no. Well, I guess here we go. Oh, coffins. That's nice. So I got no light. Nowhere else to go. Yeah, there is. There's a switch on the ground, there's a ladder on the wall. Oh, there is? Oh, I see the switch now. No Mendeley's allowed in this room. Okay. I'll see you in a sec! Uh, well, shit. Oh, uh, what? Wait, can is that even possible? We need the mirror shield to do anything in here. Can I just hold on? I wanna try something. Do you wanna go through with Medley? I thought that was like I don't think that's possible. Okay, she's over there. Oh, she's fine. I'm a. She's not hurting anything. It's just dank, that's it. This dank underground lair. Who um, would have thought the dank one would have been the tree's temple? Oh, I showed you that, uh, so I went on the, uh, I went on the smash boards today. Uh-huh. Seems like the instrument. Yeah, we've kind of <laughs> had to know that but to get here. What is with these late instructions for medley? After you've activated the second switch you need to fly to. Hey, by the way, I can fly! Come on. Come on, you can do it. She's not gonna aim down. <laughs> you can do it, man. No! Fuck. I, I do what you tell me to do, not what you want me to do. Bentley, be a pal! Was that fish chick a Sundara? Yes, Ruto fish chick was very Sundara. Yeah, until she grew up. Then she was just, uh, then she was just assertive. She was playful. You're my husband. Which is more than any of the others said. <laughs> just... Link doing his voodoo magic to command Medley. <laughs> you will go to the left. Okay, whatever you say, I guess. <laughs> Why are you doing that? <laughs> All right, we got a key. We can go to, through that other. Oh, for fuck's sake! Oh, floor, floor masters, floor masters, whatever. How do I? Guess we just weren't fast enough. She's probably at the start of the dungeon now. God damn it! All right, come at. Oh, I'll, I'll go too. Well, we're, they're gonna end up. We gotta get her anyway, right? So. Take me where you will, hand. Medley! Where are you? Hello? You're gonna 
have to like command her out, aren't you? Can I even? I don't think Ocarina Link was particularly interested in any girls. Charles, or at least he didn't show it. Oh, okay, I can totally get out of here then. So yeah, that worked as a, as a cool little shortcut. I, uh... I went to Smashports today expecting the Me Gunner forum to be totally, uh... We still have that room on the other side to do, don't we? Uh, I thought we got... I thought we finished it. We didn't? I guess... Yeah, we need the mirror shield to do more, don't we? Yeah. Okay, never mind. I expected the Me Gunners forum to be just, like, exploded since the Sans thing. But, uh, it, it wasn't. It was just, like, one guy there who was, uh, resp telling people to go to the Discord. Because apparently there is a Me Gunner Discord. And a Discord for every, every character in Smash. They yeah. have their own mains Discord. Which, that was all Sans. It is the yeah. Sans Discord now. Yeah. Well, Sans is now a character. I want, I want them to eventually just refer to the character as just Sans. Yeah, the, the trio of me Brawler, me Swordfighter, and Sans. It's me Swordfighter, Team Rocket, and uh... I don't think Team Rocket will ever become like synonymous with the, the Brawlers. But they have, they have themed their uh, Discord around them. So people are excited for the Team Rocket costumes as well. Yeah. yeah. Alright. <sighs> so you played uh, Breath of the Wild, Charles? I, I'm aware that there is a, a female Zora in Breath of the Wild. I'm also aware that Falco Lombardi is in Breath of the Wild. <laughs> Dorito, man. There, oh, there's evil Sheik in the Sheik in that uh, in that game. There is. Yeah, Iga. I don't, that might have been a plot point, though. I don't know. That was new. Yeah, that's cool. I like that. Oh. Oh wait, what? But ha oh fuck! Remember the Armos room in the Spirit Temple? Shit. I guess I can. Can I lift him? Do you even lift, bro? You are on a time limit. They will unfreeze. I'm trying. Do I need it? Fucking. You probably need to take Medley with you. I don't know for sure. Sister did. I watched a playthrough. I am uh, completely blind to Breath of the Wild. Me and Jack have not watched any footage. Oh uh, yeah, I beat it. <laughs> so uh, trying, fuck you, you slimes. Trying to keep it that way till we play. Yeah, I I know very little about it other than like. I do know that both the Zora and the Rita are in Breath of the Wild for some reason. I don't know how that's explained. If it's explained, I don't want to know if it is explained. So uh, we'll wait till we play Breath of the Wild. Is there a way to kill those guys? Shoot them, probably. When they... You have to get close enough for them to come out and then shoot them. Medley, wait here. I guess maybe those are supposed to be the Dexy hands again. But they drag you to back to the beginning of the stage, so... Could be either. Right, how's this gonna work? So I need to move him back? Only way you can move that one. Okay, I guess we're doing it. Lights up! I can't move it. Not strong enough. I need the help of Medley as well, I guess. 
the uh, symbols on the wall can be shined on. I don't know, I, I kind of figured that. Harsh. What? <laughs> Just they're not spoilers, so fuck them. Undo medley. Can you shine on that statue? Uh, sure. Oh shit! Wrong button. There must be a way to make like the statue disappear so we can move that block. Yep. Chest full of rupees. Chest full of rupees. I think the other one's the wind temple, too. The one we don't have a bird in. <laughs> yeah, you're right. It is the wind temple. Straying for medley. What? As long as you have the compass, you can find where she's at. Oh, that's easy. Mr. Popo been playable in any Dragon Ball game. Oh, what happened? What? Uh, oh. You're it's possessed. It, like, reverses your controls, right? Yeah. 
So wait, how am I supposed to... Well, that seems just annoying. That's just mildly inconvenient. Alright, next part. So we gotta get up there. Darn. Climb ladders. Yeah, list, list game appearances, but not uh, what ones he's playable in. Oh, uh, wow. Blue Popo. Blue Popo. Superior to Black Popo. Maybe. thing? Oh. So all that just to get a fucking pendant. Very valuable, those pendants. Not like they're everywhere on the sea. I, 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 remem I remember Team Four Star Blue Popo, yes. I am Blue Popo. We don't have the key. How do I get the fucking key? I looked on the on the Dragon Ball wiki. It had a list of games he appeared in, but not ones he's playable in. I'll get this. What the fuck? Oh, okay. So I... But I would go up there, but I don't have the... Oh, here we go. Oh, there's a Reddit post. Any video games you can play as Mr. Popo. Hey! Welcome, friends! So, uh, Redads are in this game. They look a little different. <laughs> I like the design of this one. With they look deader. They have, like, no, no waist. Wait, hold on. I'm gonna... What happens if I set you on fire? No effect! Chris Sabat wants a playable Mr. Popo in Dragon Ball Fighter Z. That's not gonna happen. I don't think. God, the scream is more horrible in this one! So why it setting it on fire does nothing. Nope. No Gibdos in uh, Wind Waker. Ice doesn't do anything. God, how, how do I... Bombs, that's it. Well, as of four years ago, there weren't any, apparently. Yeah! Blow up the dead! With your long-taking bombs. They don't even have an attack that you can, like, uh, do the action command for. Yeah, they just stun you. And bringing Medley down here was a mistake. I'm having to fight corpses and shit. Characters you want that have never been playable. Princess Snake. Why? Did you need that filler? <laughs> GT Gohan. Go go ten. Go <laughs> nice uh, big green reference there. Yeah. Gohan, little green. 
GT trunks. That's exactly it's the same as adult trunks. So, I never got why, like, future Gohan needed to be his own character in the game, separate from, like, Boo Saga Gohan. He's got one arm. That's unique. Just, uh, sealing stuff from the undead. How is it? Grave robbing. There's no easy way to fight these guys. Not really. You just kind of. Unless. Kinda... Hold on. I'm gonna try something. What's the song of passing? Song of passing? Yeah, because we got the song of passing. That's the time song. I doubt. You can try it. I'm gonna try it. Last one? When's Requiem? Did. Right, left, down. So this is a sun song. So theoretically, this should work. No, nope. it doesn't. Darn. Just gonna have to. Remember get... when songs had utility? Just gonna have to get his attention and let him take the first scream. That bombs work, I guess. You should do the the Luffy method for dealing with zombies. <laughs> so walk up and shove them right back in the ground. <laughs> this doesn't belong here. <laughs> Oh, an old man with serious injuries! Can you, uh, can you get out, Leslie? Uh, I don't think we'll play Shadow of the Colossus before Breath of the Wild. We're, we're pretty eager to get to Breath of the Wild. Yes. Though if it's any consolation, Jack has played Dark Souls, which he has also compared it to. The, there was a com it was a comic. What? It wasn't like it was my comparison. I, I, I was quoting a comic. What? No, Charles compared Breath of the Wild to Dark Souls. Oh, did he? Yeah. Oh, okay, never so mind that. like Dark Soulsy, in some ways. I'd like to check it out. Right, well, we got a key, so that's all that matters. So we're going over here. What? Wait, but... Medley, why you no come? She can't join us. This is something we have to do alone. Oh, these guys are making first appearance. Mini-boss music for this fuck? Yeah, clearly. Very different style folks than uh, the usual incarnation. These ones have got, like, giant clubs. Immune to fire! Immune to arrows, it would seem. Although... No effect. What the?! Not only is there no effect, it grants them intangibility somehow. different in Smash. I don't remember fighting these guys, and I guess they didn't appear, like, often enough. What? Oh, no. There's... They appear more in the late game. I but wonder... you, you said you'd never beaten this game. So I, I, I have! I said I beat this game, I oh. think. I haven't beaten Pokemon. Although I might not have, I don't know. I don't have the fond memories like I do of like Wind Waker. Ocarina? 
sorry, not Aqua, not to, uh, uh, Majora's Mask is what I was talking about. Whoops. Focused in scoop. Like if Link just had his boy sword and horse. What is it like every time you kill Colossus and Shadow of the Colossus, uh, sad music starts playing? You got the mirror shield. Cool. Oh, where's the Majora design? The, the, the oh, face. <laughs> the best mirror shield. What's this one look like in comparison? Kind of holy. Is there like a... I, it's got the Triforce on it, I can see that. Kind of. Oh, his, his bow. A boy. Boar. I... <laughs> hey, it's nice and bright now. So we got so we're slowly cleansing the temple with the power of light. Yeah. The music and the game is like, yeah. Bedley, where are you? Oh, there you are. Come. Oh, hey, look. Supply of skulls. Actually, wait, hold on. If they're ghosts... Hey, ghost! Oh, no. Oh, it doesn't kill them, it just makes them vulnerable. Tangible. I'll be back for you in a second, Ghost. If only we had the light arrows. Totally not overpowered light arrows. <laughs> the bet they're the finest light arrows in any game. Were light arrows in Link to the Past? Uh, they're silver arrows. Or no, wait. Yeah, they were silver arrows, and they were required to kill, uh, Ganon. They could just use the Master Sword. The Master Sword helped, but... But you need the light arrows in order to finish it off. Finish them off. Or, the silver arrows. Because there were no light arrows. Alright, what's next? So, we got that. So, here's what I'll do. Medley! Do you feel as though music improves your performance when playing a game? Uh, I've been listening to see, it depends on the music. I've been, like, I once tried listening to Death Grips while uh, playing Smash. It didn't really help. It was actually kind of distracting. But uh, I've been taken to you two, like, playing Synthwave and, like, that kind of stuff. Some, some like, low-key, like, uh, chill, chill wave type stuff. And it's been, and I've been having some success. It allows me to just kind of zone out. Just focus on the game, which I kind of have trouble with. Let's try this. Me personally, I find it distracting, so it's, it's by person. Yeah. Shit. Come on. Get back further. Oh, I see it. Aziz Light! <laughs> Aziz? Aziz? That's the. You, you've never seen Fifth Element. Or, yeah, the Fifth Element, have you? No. There was a scene where this guy was, like, transcribing runes inside this temple, but it was before, like, lamps and, like, uh, like flashlights and shit. So they just had. So he just had this mirror from, like, the surface 
being reflected onto where he's reading, and occasionally the boy would, like, fall asleep. And so, as a result, the, occasionally he would just yell out, like, Aziz, light! To, like, wake him back up. So then, like, aliens come down during this, right? To get inside the temple, and he's just looking. And then, like, the light fades Rupees. again because the ship Rupees. comes down. Rupees. And oh, then... five, okay. And then he yells out, Aziz, light! And then the ship just turns on all its, like, fucking, like, floodlights, right? And he just goes, much better, thank you, Aziz. There was more to do back there. Oh, was there? I see. Here. No. Stay there. Don't, Don't look stay over there. this way. Oh. No, it's gonna work. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> I made it work. Load my fucking coffers. So what was it? Twenty-three hundred was what we needed. Uh, it was 3,200. Okay, so we're still got a thousand to go. If I'm playing a game that's like uh, like tedious or was taking a lot of time, I'll watch something while playing it. I usually watch something while playing games anyway. I, I won't just like uh, play a game and listen to music. I only really listen to music in the car because I can't do anything else while I'm driving. Yeah, it, uh, I listen to I like, uh, when I was working, uh, when I was still working for uh, the security company, I used to just listen to podcasts while driving to and from my sites. Anything on the left side of this? Uh, oh, you mean over there? Yeah. Okay, let's check. Yeah, no. Just some bones. At least we don't have to collect fairies in these. Yeah. <laughs> okay, one hat, one side's lit. Let us light the other side. This creepy fertility doll face. <laughs> I banished the curse. All right. Wasn't, wasn't there another room we couldn't do because we didn't have the mirror shield? I'm on back the there. Right side of this room. Oh, that one. Oh yeah, that's right. Let's go there. Might be where we get the boss key. Now these. these... Nope. No medley. Come on. Can't even hop. I get. I say hop. It's as like his full body height as that ledge. It's fine, you know what, though? Go away, slimes. Alright, now we need to, uh... This is where we're go was supposed to go. No, it was... Did we maybe, go the wrong maybe way? Maybe the other direction. That w yeah. Oh. <laughs> Damn it! I just the ju I got all the jukes. All right, let's go. What time is it, by the way? Four o'clock. Okay. Fuck! I just Shoot cannot. It. Shoot it. It's fine. I know where she is. That was almost a power cord. Hello, Medley. Command Medley. I think there's some kind of mechanic to the, like this in uh, Phantom Hourglass. 
with you uh, controlling the, the ghost possessed Zelda in the armor or something. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't know the details of that. <laughs> These guys can take some hits. Yeah. Okay. I have no idea. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna fight this guy myself. Probably a good idea. No! You scared? Let's go sword the dude. He's got a very... What? What?! How get out? Do you have to, like, shine light on it? I don't understand this fucking mechanic at all. Where are we? We're back here. What about Medley? Is she up there? No? She's still in the room? Alright. Alright, I'm back. Still and so are the hands. Back. Does it only attack me if I'm carrying Medley? I don't know. Alright, well, in that case, I got a new strategy. Medley, you go first. Yeah, Dexy hand. It's looking for me. Wait on the switch, Medley. Okay. <laughs> well, what are we going to do? We're going to have to cheat. we get a joy pendant that certainly was worth it you still need these right you haven't gotten all of the joy pendant rewards <laughs> she's probably waiting in the beginning of the room let's let's go oblige great now we will never have to come here again that's like was that all that was in there? Yeah, it was just joy pendant. <laughs> I would have preferred rupees, honestly. If Link is holding a lit bomb, the floor masters will not attack. What? Uh oh. Those look like curse bubbles. Did you just- Motherfucker, did you just laugh at me? It doesn't seem to work on them. Well, what am I gonna use then? Boomerang? I think- I think maybe we've encountered them before and we had to use wind? Yeah, okay. It doesn't mention, like, a good strategy. Other than- Vulnerable, vulnerable to being Shit. frozen with the ice arrows, but what I these guys? No, the the hands. Oh, I don't know if that includes when they're in their holes, though. Come on. So uh. I'm gonna have to go down a bit. Damn it! I miss. I miss shot. Miss fired. Damn it. Go 
cool. I predict we're gonna need to, to enable something in this room. Yeah. Come on, Medley. We're just seeing better days. Way better. Oh, that's just the same fucking... How will you solve this puzzle? Hmm. It's one of those puzzles that's not really a puzzle. Like yep. the, uh, the block of ice appearing suddenly in the water temple. Yeah. Or the Great Bay Temple. <laughs> we need her to open it up to the... How'd the boss get in here? So it killed the Zora, and then just made this its home. Yes. And tucked itself way deep down in the bottom of the temple. Oh, yes. That's how, that's how that happens. Wait a minute. What's over there? I don't know. Should we try getting over there yet, or should we uh, go through the door first? I think I can make it. Because we know, we know we can go through the door. Uh, that was a redead. Oh, fuck. Alright. Let's try light. Up. Oh, it stuns them. <laughs> Don't like the light. Is that who is the, the enemy is going to be? The queen of darkness and evil. Isn't that every Sailor Moon villain, though? Yeah, queen of... Something darkness, something evil, something, something. Something, 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 something dark side. I mean, surely Twilight the, will be a, a, a happier, partier, fun-filled game. Y you know what? If the level design improves, or if the dungeon design improves in Twilight, I'm not gonna complain. Dungeons are my favorite part. Hello. Hmm. <laughs> Did they just throw a rock at us? Throw a skull. It seems like it. So I have no idea. I think we just have to run across. Maybe, probably not with Medley, because Medley's gonna get grabbed by the hand. Maybe this is a Medley gate, we just have to go without her. Can't use my arrows either. Okay, it wears off, now we can hammer. Hammer? Jack, look around. Oh. <laughs> I remember, if I remember correctly, the camera isn't awful in Twilight. Well, that's good. Well, that's nice when a game's camera isn't awful. Okay, now we do need metal. Yeah, I, I think. I assume. Yeah, I'll get her. trigger then. Do I need a... Who's that's 
statue forward or something? I don't know. Can you? Oh. That makes a lot more sense than, uh... Well, you could try putting her in position first. I don't know. Let me see if I can move the statue. Yep, I can. Adley, you're in the way. Move. Oh, we didn't have to get her over here at all. Yeah. It's fine. She can... She can fly back. Can't even use the Wind Waker. Wow, curses got worse. Worse than Majora somehow. <laughs> Nothing beats the fuck Queen Helenia's like time twisting curse. Oh, well, that's right. The Sailor Moon is first couple episodes of season five are doing a Back to the Future plot. Oh, uh, they'll fuck up the marriage. The future daughter won't exist. She's <laughs> fading from the timeline. Yeah. <laughs> Not quick enough. She's... We have to go back, Chibi. We have to get your parents to fuck. <laughs> we gotta, we gotta fix their marriage. Man, the man it's a shame the di di you have to take the prince. With you. The prince di diamond. Uh, Demande. The secondary uh, backup plan didn't didn't work. You know, you know which one that is, right? Uh, she gets together with Demande. Yeah, that's the backup. <laughs> Backup fuck. Backup father. An alternate continuity. We, we've already gotten, like, two daughters from the future. Fuck it, have a daughter come from an alternate future. Yeah, I mean... Prince Prince Dimande's daughter comes to join the fight. <laughs> da okay, damn it. I, I am too easily lost. So those... Mirror. Get rid of that statue, we know that. Oh, yeah. And we can hit both of those mirrors, whatever that does. We already did that, though. Did we? Oh, yeah, we did. So we still need a key to get up to access that. Yeah, door, yeah, we do. So. Hold on. So the room we were in was uh, that one down there. But we gotta get a key, but a key is in the... Do I need to just go into the miasma room? Probably. Okay, well... Enter the Naraku miasma. Wait, wait here, Medley. I'll, I'll be back soon. Wait, this is in the miasma room. Other miasma room. I have many miasma rooms. How, fu how fucked up would a Naraku temple be? I guess he does live in, like, a, a feudal Japanese mansions. Remember when he just chilled out in that holy mountain? Yeah, he did do that. Just as a as an abomination, eldritch lump of flesh in the core of the mountain. Talking about Inuyasha. He met. Like I always talk about how cool, how much cooler uh, stuff would be if this stuff was allowed to cross over more. And I was just thinking, like. Uh, like, just imagine somebody from DC, like, fucking Bane or Slate or somebody just doing some, uh, some shit in the feudal universe. Where's the chest? Oh. Well, there, there he goes. There we go. Oh, it cleared the miasma right up. It's a lot of hands. I guess there was, like, a, a safe route to take. Was, That's why I was curious why you kept rolling straight through the hands instead of avoiding them. Th I was avoid- wait, hold on. They, they were distracted There's by another skulls. chest in here. Are they expecting me to- Is there? Yeah. Yeah, it's supposed to be right over here, I oh, guess. They want you to, like, kill all the hands. Yeah. <laughs> Can't be worth it if- So if Link gets grabbed, he has time to react with a sword attack. Well- you know what that reminds me of? It reminds me of the, uh, dot hack sign opening. That guitar oh, chord. Oh, yeah. Well, I guess we're back in the room of two mirrors. Let's, uh... I can't play it because, uh, whatever company owns dot hack sign is... We'll go, we'll it's copy Sony. We'll copyright our con... We'll, we'll like, uh, they took down one of our one of our Awesome Knots videos because there was dot hack music in it. Yeah, they don't like... I don't like people using their music. 
<laughs> Other companies mon like copyright monetize it. That's the only one that's been taken down so far. Oh, the Redeads are back. It's fine. We, we got, got our key. We got what we need. Also, Redeads are pretty chill. They'll just leave you alone if you just don't even go into their general area. Yeah. Can't believe they backed out of them being undead in the 64 ones. That that no, they're just monsters from dark magic, wearing masks. They're not corpses. You had something legitimately creepy, and you just decided to fuck it, fuck all of it, just fuck it. Even though every sign in game pointed to them to them being corpses. Can they? Can you go in the light? Yeah, you I can. I don't think it affects them. Oh, it's, oh, it doesn't even stun them. It just plays a noise for some reason. Oh no, you're hitting the ghost as well. You idiot! You exercised yourself. Maybe <laughs> an interesting, like, uh, uh, writing prompt. You are a ghost who wants to leave this world, but can't. You wish to exercise yourself. <laughs> you How do you do it? You decided you're gonna exercise. No, Bedley! I, I changed my mind. I can't. Well, I'm not sure how to explain this. Very timely, as always, Medley. It's just... I can't... What triggers these? I don't know. It's always... Really late. Get over here. Gee, did she just go nah? Oh. <laughs> you too, huh? Fight fire with fire. I missed. Damn it, this is so jank. Oh no, the fire flower made the lava bubbles stronger. I missed that one too. It's not. I don't think it's working. <laughs> The fact that his fire powers him up, while the arrow pierces him, causing a net zero damage. Redirected. That's weird, because I think I can... Oh, because the light's coming in this yeah. way. That explains why I was having trouble. Okay. of this temple left. I don't think there is. Oh, I remember. I think I remember there's like a big room at the end of it. A big room? Yeah. Big bada room? Bada bing bada room. Awaken. See this shit coming, did ya? There we go. I knew you. Oh, for Wait, what? Days. What? There's something else over there. I don't think there is. Oh, just the item? I guess it's just the item. Thought it was something else. Oh well. Ten rupees. So yeah, this wouldn't be able to be set up if that mirror wasn't there. Okay, keep going. Boss room's coming up, I think. Oh, this looks like a pleasant chamber. Lots of sarcophagophaguses. Okay, no. It's all fucking... Was... 
the corpse chamber. The earth... It's like fucking Skyrim where they just like but necropoli filled with just Draugr. They didn't want to call it the Shadow Temple, but that's basically what this one is. A skeleton dude's back. I'm glad these aren't all re-deads. like one of the heaviest but also one of the most damaging things in the game. He tries. Alright, are there any more skeletons to fight? No. Skeletons. And then re-dead. Whap. Die! <laughs> Die, monster! Just clubbing, clubbed to death. Ow. And yet the nail board is one of the shittier weapons in Death Road to Canada. Yeah. You just, need to get, you just need to get attacks in. Yeah. Nothing you can really do to cheese those enemies without, like, sources of light. Alright. Medley, let's go. We need to play our song for the temple. Almost done with this. We really just cram, cram a lot of content. I, I just trapped myself in the bathroom. Oh it shit! Happens to the best of us. It happened like, to me you, too. Like, are you trapped right now? At least you've got your phone and a charge. You you want you want us to call for help? Where do you live? I, I think because he's got a phone, he could do that if he really needed to. to go get the appropriate tool for opening the bathroom door. Ours had like a weird lock or something on it. This yeah. doesn't look like a short chamber. Do I need to throw her over there? Key. Oh yeah, that's right. Do we need her though? I don't know. Look around before you throw her anywhere. Is there anything above us? There does not Nothing appear to be above anything us. above us, so it wants us to go down there. To down the stairs. Uh, both of us or one of us? Oh. I'll bring both of us just to be safe. You're fine. Oh. Yeah, this is the room I was thinking of. So we got two chests and a lot of mirrors. Oh Jesus Christ. Alright. So there's a there's a thing up there. There's a button on top of the center. That, uh, which one of us needs to press it? Anyone well, of us? Only Medley can get up there, I think. Alright. I'm glad you got out, Charles. Endo 
I left the door now bounce. Oh! So oh, it's not that's... permanent now. Can she step off? Yeah, she yeah, can. Okay. okay, good. Alright, fuck. Well, I'm not looking forward to this. This, uh... Alright, McLinkus. Didgeridoo is associated with death in Australia. It has a very eerie sound to it. Yeah. I remember it, that was the, like, the most, the eeriest instrument in uh, Crash Bandicoot as well. Because it was in the track for those, those boulders chasing you levels. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> Creepy. Okay, come at me. So the lock was stuck shut. That... <laughs> Remember when I when I got locked in, in when I locked myself out of the bathroom? In, in the bathroom? No, out of the bathroom. It was oh, that's when right. I was trying to get ready for work, and then uh, your uniform was inside. Yeah, and I'm like, I'm like, double fuck, double fuck gum. Hey, cool, fifty rupees. That's just great. Remember the double mint twins? They existed. The what? It was an ad campaign for Double Mint Gum. They had a bunch. They had twins. <laughs> okay, so. Oh yeah, it didn't. Oh yeah, that was in a in a reader, right? Like a bathroom reader. They were talking about it. Oh maybe. Or something, and then one of the twins tragically died, or something. I I don't know. I think that's how I remember it. We knew a guy in uh, Job Corp who uh, got stuck in a bathroom. He, w he was a big fella. He got stuck and had to try climbing out the window and then got stuck in the window. <laughs> yeah, that sounds that sounds like a Job Corp story. I'll be back for you. Well, I'm gonna move the statue. Why? The statue that needs to be... I thought... No? Oh, go back in there. In here? Do this first. Oh. Okay. Sorry, a big room, but very confusing. First. Oh, you only had a spackle scrape. Alright. First thought was to remove the hinges, but the door was stuck. I'm on the edge of my seat. I wonder what's gonna happen next. Then I thought maybe I could climb down. But I'm remarkably unfit. Wait, oh, you were in the. It was a top floor uh, bathroom? Second story window. Ah. Didn't feel like plummeting on the asphalt below. No. Nobody wants to. So asphalt, Fulton Rass. The Fulton. Remember when there was a pony episode named after the Fulton R Stars? Yeah, I, I pointed it out to him like, I was like, what? That's and you're like, a very kids thing to reference. And was it you're like, what's wrong? And I'm like, that's about cancer. I, mean, I didn't know what it was. <laughs> Oh, this is, <laughs> look at this, oh, whoops, Medley, you light up my life, this, oh, I keep, this time, I'll never be hypnotized by that poor chorus, Link. <laughs> Rip. Is that even what I'm supposed what I'm supposed to do? I assume. Even. Yeah. Okay. 
Let's try that again. Spackle scraped the shit out of the exposed mechanism and pulled it from the bottom of the door. Attempt two. There we go. Sweet. I think we're finished with this puzzle. Oh no. Oh, shit. Hmm. Well, this makes it even harder to get that statue. Maybe just go to the platform where Medley is. Maybe you can reflect it from there still. <laughs> Fell on me, but hey, I'm free. Oh. Oh, that's fine. I mean, we did, we did need her there. Hey. What? Medley! Just throw her out of the way. I'm good. BRB. Don't get locked in the bathroom again. Oh, this will complete the circuit. Light circuit. Wait, it's what? The invention of fiber optics. <laughs> Minus the fiber. <laughs> what is this temple? It's an old school fiber optics setup. It's a cool uh, camera jank that was going on there. <laughs> Is Link making farting noises when he starts moving? I don't think so. I keep hearing that. We did it! W, W, W! What exactly do we fucking do? Fiber optics, Jack! So there's that. Now we need to move more mirrors. Oh my god. Wrong. This fucking puzzle absolutely sucks shit. It's cool but tedious. Oh look! Another mirror! Like you shouldn't have! Like setting up a million dominoes to knock over. Drop, drop, drop the game. Oh, there's a... There's what? A thing on the wall. Uh, joy pendant, of course. Very valuable. They spread joy. With a Y. <laughs> Charles missed that gem. <laughs> uh, what are you doing? I'm trying to, to see left. how to... Left. Left. There you go. Oh. That's what you're talking about. All right, let's continue. Uh, another room. How many fucking? Those are all gonna be redeads, and they're gonna... that's what the lights for, isn't There's it? There's a chest. You have to fight through Wait. redeads. Oh. Does it hurt the skeletons? Uh, it does not. Nope. Skeletons are immune to light. Ah, oh, shit. They're tough bastards. Yeah, they're skeletons. I wonder what a uh, Wind Waker wolf house would look like. Whack, wacky, a bit. Deal damage to the, the head when you're attacking. The yeah, body. it's just to the end of getting it off. Yeah, they just tank some damage and then and then they tank more damage and then you got them and then hey, there's enjoy the healing. I bet they die faster if you club them. <sighs> club to death. Well, let's find out. Out with you. It won't even open if you don't do light on it, will it? Okay. That was creepy. I thought that was just a holding nowhere for a second. Oh, okay. Fuck, that's good enough. Alright. 
Have a taste your own medicine. You skeleton bastard. He's barely affected by it. Holy shit. Double good wax. Club it. Club it with fire. Clubbed to death. That, except it's a, it's a book about, uh, like, a serial killer who attacks people at nightclubs. <laughs> and then... He just, uh, he just drugs them on, like, some really hardcore stimulants and just forces them to listen to club music really loud, and that's how he kills them. Have you ever heard of Huey Lewis in the news? <laughs> what, what was he talking about? Was that the band they talked about? Yeah! In scene? You like Huey Lewis in the news? Uh, they're okay. <laughs> what am I doing here? There was a... There, there's, there's a parody of that scene done by Huey Lewis himself in Weird Al. I think you, I think you showed me that. Yeah. I think I saw that. You ever watch American Psycho? <laughs> Guantanamo Bay? What? Uh, we're, we're referencing American Psycho. Club to... Oh! <laughs> that, yeah, that's rumored. That's what they did uh, to, to prisoners in Gitmo. Was that uh, they would they would uh, just play music really loud to break people's wills? Not strong. Look look at these big ass mirrors he's moving. <laughs> Why is he? I guess it's just he's just not used to like awkwardly using the weapon or something. Wait, what? But what point does this serve being here? What the f- Oh, okay. Oh, not just loud music, weird music. Oh, uh, we need medley. Bah. Yeah. Where, Where are you? We'll find out. Like Barney's. Okay. Man, you know you, you know the torturers are the most effective when they when they get like creative like that. Where are you going? I. It's not this one. It's not that one? Nope. Well, what, what one is it then? It, Whoops! You... Shit. This room is just really fucking with me. Just follow the light path to the end. That's the beginning. Okay. Over here. Yeah. Okay, I get it now. Uh, so, where, where, where am I supposed to reflect it to then? In the mirror? I, you can probably reflect it down to that little floor panel below for Link to then reflect into the wall. Oh, like that one down there? Yeah. Okay. Probably right. Man, I hope I hope in the in the remake of this game they make the they make the command melody into a C item. This is just the iron boots all over again. Yeah. Tedious feature you have to activate and reactivate over and over and over again. Have I told you about Patriot, Jack? Patriot? The uh, Netflix question mark show? Uh, I've never seen Patriot. I've never heard of it either. I typically tend to avoid uh, those kinds of like. Oh God! Is now is it is it an earnest? Tell me, Amazon. You tell me about Patriot. Is it any good? So what's back in that room? This one? Nothing. 
Oh. Just one of those pots. Dark comedy. Oh, is it like a Bojack Horseman? Is it like, is it like, oh, is it like King of the Hill? So now where's this going? Uh, fucking hell. I do <laughs> Okay, it is now complete. Now we can shine from both of these pedestals onto the eyes. Okay. Get the fuck out of this room. Right, hopefully this last time, Medley. That's not what he said, I'm just making a joke. <laughs> it's just a guy working at a CIA torture. It's about a very unlucky boy. Nonetheless committed an effective secret agent. Oh, that's uh <laughs> isn't, so it it's funny, like... isn't it funny when bad things happen to good people? Haha. -ha. That's why that's why you gotta make them kind of jerks to balance it out. Then you you're like, wait, why do we why are we, are we watching? Closer to the face. There we go. Closer to the face. What? You're in the wrong place. Oh, this to the left. Left. There you go. Straight ahead. Walk straight ahead. You're on the wrong pedestal. Oh, what? But left. here? Oh, that one. Okay. There you go. All he wants to do is play football. Blinded by the light. All he wants Wrapped up like a dude. I just... That wasn't the original version of that song, you know. Oh, really? It was a cover by... I don't remember who did... Was it Hugh Lewis? Did the, the well-known one? It was by someone else, and then that original artist commented about the one that became popular. Yeah, the song never took off when I wrote it until this guy rewrote it to be about a feminine hygiene product. I like a douche in the... Because that's not the lyrics. That's how it's misheard because of the way the guy sings it. Come on. Got This is why I, I, I say everybody needs to learn uh, learn meditation. That way if you're ever trapped in a endless hell loop with music, you can just kind of zone out and it won't, won't affect you. Is that a dark nut? Alright, dark nut, let's go. That's a ghost. Oh, uh, it's a curse skeleton. You want to deal with that immediately. You should drop what you're doing. Uh, wind? Oh, what do you hit it with? Ice. No, oh, that works. Guess it's a. Uh, Ice arrows are good. Remember how we used to say, oh, ice arrows are shit. Well, They're they useless, used to be. but then now we got. Oh, what? I lost the targeting. What? Oh, that... Alright, now I can fight you. Oh. Holy shit, I... Somehow that worked. It's locked. If I had a big key, I could open it. Can you imagine me you'd get a key to open the chest that contained the boss key? Sorry, the big key. The big key. I wonder if big key was a mistranslation in the in legend in Link to the Past. Was it also called big key there? It was key, yeah. This is a mistranslation they're running with. This lock like, is really big. Like King Koopa Bowser. I mean, that wasn't a mistranslation. I was renaming the character. Dear P Pesky Plumbers, my name is King Koopa, not Bowser. Hey, it's Eggman. I guess I guess you're gonna have to fly up here, Medley. 
Dear meddling hedgehog, my name is Eggman. I don't know where you got Robotnik from. <laughs> he, Dr. Ivo Eggman Robotnik. I'm Eggman, yes, I'm the real Eggman. All the other Eggman aren't as bad as I am. You ever see that that parody? No. It's, uh... Wait! Oh, for fuck's sake! Link doesn't know how to hold a door for a lady. Where'd she go? Damn it. Death battle. Eggman versus Eggman versus Eggman. <laughs> Games Eggman vs. Saturday Morning Comics Eggman vs. Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog Eggman. Where's so where does Sonic Egg X Eggman fall into it? I think he was more in line with just the egg the the games version. He wasn't really drastically rewritten from his game counterpart. As opposed to the Saturday morning and uh, comics ones were totally redesigned. Yeah. Alright, come on. You should probably direct message it to Jack if you want him to see it. Yeah, uh, after I'm done streaming, before I go to work. Patriot. This is a show called Patriot. I'm expecting something very serious. It looked but very serious. <laughs> Dark comedy. Patriot footage, but dubbed over with the American Dad theme. I'm, I'm, whenever I think of Patriot now, I think of, uh, that Netflix, uh, that Netflix, uh, Punisher series. Yeah? Where it had the subplot about a dude who was, uh, who fought in, like, in, like, a Middle East war. He came back and he's just obviously still fucked up from it and he just can't adapt. And things get worse for him. Yeah? And... It's just... There was at one point he just dug out like a like a foxhole in the middle of his like backyard that and his uh his dude at this who does support me just comes by he's like hey what, what's going on y you feeling okay he's just there just there just kind of blank faced like yeah everything's fine it's across from us yeah, at the door oh yeah you're right shit all right so we probably want to have Medley fly over herself I don't yeah, know if she can make that here's what I'll do. Serious, but at the same time not. Oh, how are we gonna get over there? We have to deck a leaf. Deck a leaf. Yeah. Uh, uh, it's it's a simple it's a simple jump. A simple matter. Gee, McLinkus, was all this part of your plan? Of course. Can't get the Bane voice. Just I can't get the Bane voice right. Of course. <laughs> You're a big guy. For you. I can fly too. I don't need you, Medley. Wow, how'd you get over here? Hold on a second. Uh, gotta finish looting the temple. Very important. It, it, it's a. Uh, we need it for to fight for the revolution. There was a uh, very few dungeons in this game, but this was a long one. This was very expansive. Yeah, the other one's probably gonna be pretty big too. Wait yeah. here! What the? What a terrifying foe. Boogie boogie boogie. You can tell they mean business by the xylophone. It's King Poe. This game's soundtrack got very simple and very cartoony compared to the previous ones. Yeah. Okay. Shine the light in his crotch, it's the only way. Oh, what? No, it, cutting his tender flesh would be the make too much sense. Are you serious? He has no balls, Jack. You're gonna have to get Mario with this son of a bitch. I have to climb him? What? Oh! 
That's dumb. It's a little obtuse. Especially since he looks so soft and vulnerable. That didn't do anything, though. Oh, I have to throw him in spikes. Shit. Crawl attack! So long, Gepo! Did I get him? That got him. Oh. Well, it broke him. Oh, that's how you... It's the big boo method. The... I got some of them. No, my hatred is leaving me! This version of Pose kind of looked like Heartless. Like this should be in Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> oh, he's immune right now. Uh, now? Like this would be a ghost we see in Agrabah. Yeah. I, I can see it. <laughs> ah, ghost's one weakness. Spikes. I only got one of them. Shit. Is he gonna change up his attack pattern now? Are, are the lights vanishing? Maybe. Ah, fuck. This dire, threatening boss music. Oh, the lights are vanishing! Or they're moving, at least. Yeah. speedrunners deal with this guy. There's a particularly, like, best way to get rid of so many ghosts at once. It'd be interesting to check out. Got one. My hatred is fading. What are you doing? If you kill the ghosts, I'll lose all that I am. Sounds good. Sounds like Sly Cooper music mixed with, like... I'm gonna pull out the fat ghost. Actually, wait, hold on. End up fighting a giant re-dead or something. Yeah, that's didn't kill. What am I doing? So there's three left. It's not like they're particularly hard to kill with a sword, though. There's two hits. Yeah. Actually, hold on. There we go. Oh, he, he suck. He attack. He protect. Most of all, he suck dick. Shit. I'm... I was too hesitant. What's going on on the ceiling? I don't know. What is going on on the ceiling? What are you... Ghost magic? Uh, it's just holes. I guess so. Sometimes they open, sometimes they don't. There we go. Gotcha. No! Am I in peace? Huh? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, I'm called now. I'm leaving. No! The ghost in Sonic was scarier than that thing. Yeah. Jack. How much sad can you bear in common? It's a very weird mix of flavors, honestly. Cool, we purified the temple. I can't particularly think of any sad comedies that I'm a fan of. I was watching Louie. That Louis C.K. like show, I'm like, this is supposed to be a comedy? Yeah. Are you fucking kidding me? I, I don't like shows where bad things happen to good people, or where bad- or good things happen to bad people. That's why I'm not crazy about Rick and Morty. 
But it's the commentary. Yeah, Venture Brothers is good. Yeah. Because it's a show about failure. <laughs> Everybody's a failure. That's what the creators describe it as. Yeah, although they're, they said they're, they want to try to walk it. But what the fuck? We gotta play our song to enchant the sword. It's the only way. Do, we really, do I really have to? Good. I don't... By which I mean you have to play the song. I'll, I'll, I'll supervise. <laughs> now just keep playing this forever until I beat Ganon. The fucking... Your life now belongs to the temple. You live here now, in this room of spikes and skulls. With your ghost fish. Ghost fish. Oh man. Regional variant of Magikarp, their ghost type. <laughs> yeah. Have there been any ghost fish? I can't think of any. Ghost water. There are, I'm sure there is. A, there are ghost water types. There's a ghost jellyfish, but not like a ghost fish fish. Yeah, let's see what, what changes about this sword. It has a hilt. It got wings. I restored the Master Sword's former energy. There is but one last step before it becomes the true Master Sword once again. So does it increase in power a little bit, or...? I have no idea. Even, not even the wiki told us. Not the... We tried to look that up. Oh yeah, there's no damage calculation. To complete the awakening of the Master Sword, you must go to the Wind Temple for one more prayer. I like how he, he removed the mask for this part, because it was too important. Yeah. Now, McLinkus, step into the light and return to the surf. Alright, come with me! No, I must stay here and continue to pray. Fucking hell. Sad. Kamali, I'm all sorry. The sages. And McLinkus. Um. About Prince Kamali. Please watch it. I'd be safe in the world! I ain't got time for that! You want me to babysit too? Gotta lock these people up in their temples. That sounds like it could be a fucking Inuyasha villain. That almost was like one of the Inuyasha villains. Yeah. Was that dude's like, oh, well, well, become a living Buddha for you. That's and what Naraku did, that you did to that guy. He put him to work, like, protecting his, his place, his yeah, mountain. Yeah, because he was like, I shouldn't have done this. I regret everything. What a, what a cool character Zombie Monk was. <laughs> yeah. It was great. That whole that arc was, the, that was great. That was the best arc of Inuyasha. It was the most interesting by far. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, we're done. <laughs> uh, yeah, we went for quite a while today. That was a... Oh, whoops. Yeah. Nope, no Elgato. Uh, Long Earth Temple full of zombies and shit. And yep. I'm sure the next temple will also be uh, very substantial. With... No, uh, no stream tomorrow. Uh, we're gonna be out and about. Yeah, we're gonna try to go to a competitive Smash again. See if yes. we can pull that off. Uh, I don't know when we'll stream next. Maybe next weekend. Uh, Maybe. Depends on how the scheduling is. But, we'll see. Uh, May I have some midday on Monday? The preschool starts Tuesday. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. We'll see you next time. See you next time.